We'll pick um, it back up. And just one more sound check, just so I can make sure. One, two, three. Cool. One. Okay. <laughs> yeah, man. Is, as long as I hear you. Good. Yeah, me, me and my friend be like red, yellow, red. Was it red leather, yellow leather? Red, red leather. Yeah, leather. Because that's how like you get the leather. words out. Yeah, red leather, yellow, yellow leather. leather, and you keep saying it until it's like red you leather, yellow. Exercise leather. Exercise the mouth. Oh shit. Or we joke. We'll just be like. <laughs> we're just stupid you know? we're just be like oh, whatever the, the, the Steve Carell whatever, whatever, whatever. Uh, ¿Qué? Juan, Juancha plancha con siete plancha con cuanta plancha yeah, plancha plancha el like diablo I've never heard that shit. no, no. no. That, that's definitely an old world that's no old. wait really yeah I've never heard I that I would have said hay un hoyo hay un hoyo de orilla del mar hay un sapo hay un sapo y donde está el hoyo that's the song yeah <laughs> Gotcha. Opportunity, promotion, blah, blah. You know, those are just words. 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 All I have to offer is words. Just words. Nobody cares. Oh, no. Nobody cares. What's going on, my beautiful peoples, on this absolutely lovely Saturday? Finally. Finally. Nice. All that rain. Yo. Oh, last finally. week was treacherous. <laughs> it was bad. Yeah. It was bad. <laughs> And finally um i just want to briefly give us a huge shout out for having the most episodes with all male cast during oh. women's history month there's no ma'am <laughs> Like I was looking back at it, I'm like, you know Bro. what? Uh, because in there, and you know, in, as a part of life, I'm always making sure that there's a, a, a different perspective, a mm. woman's perspective, in in, in our <laughs> show. And not today, but not this month, not, not this yet. month, <laughs> this whole month. I think Lady H been only one episode here. What, what, what was it? It was like it was like the the. the Evidence of absence is the absence of evidence. <laughs> yeah. maybe, maybe it's a stats. So we're yeah. just we don't have a woman this time, this month, so we could remember next month. I don't know. I'm trying. I'm trying here. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> now, give yourself some, you know, some grace. You were aware of it. Yeah. That, yeah. Too. that too. Yeah. Self awareness. Well, you were aware of it. I'm telling you. No, it was Women's Month. The <laughs> worst. <laughs> Shout, shout out to us for Those not jokes. giving into the corporate agenda right. because it's not women's month. It's, it's women's, women's year. every day. Every day. Yeah, every day. Every, shout out to all the women. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out to them. Shout yeah. out to them. We don't look at it by the month. <laughs> we don't look at it by the month. <laughs> we appreciate you every day. Every that day. lovely voice that you're hearing is my brother, my man, my main man, Trey. <laughs> what's going on? What's happening? What's popping, my people? Finally here on a beautiful Saturday. Yeah. He said, finally. Finally, you been missing? I've been missing my mind. <laughs> <laughs> you got the one on the Yeah, I don't know where, where the fuck I've been. That I mean, where you been? Know? You saw last week. <laughs> what? what did you find it? I was here. I was here. <laughs> I feel like you've been. I feel like when the weather is gloomy, your energy dims <laughs> it slightly. It does. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So I get it. As soon as the here. sun come back, it's boom. It's like Superman, right? Yeah. You get the, your, your like energy boom. from the rays exactly. of the sun. There you go. And, and, <laughs> and that other lovely voice that you're hearing is none other than yo. You know what? What was messed up last week? You said you're the reliever after we made all those no diddy jokes. Oh, and I was like, oh, ah. I forget to say so no I'm diddy not gonna, I'm not, <laughs> not no, no longer the reliever, Damn, but the starter in the game. Oh, there you go. All right, I made my the team. brother, I made the team, baby. <laughs> <laughs> my brother, my main man, Rams McFly. Yeah. That, that means I'm on salary now, right? I'm, I'm on, the, <laughs> yeah. on the payroll. Yeah, on the payroll. After, after, the, after the show, after, after, after the show, <laughs> we talk contracts yeah. later. Yeah. Yeah. The, the like, well, well, so, right. you you bring up great subjects, <laughs> <laughs> and I just realized uh, on the video side, I dropped nobody's uh, lower third. So uh, I'm gonna edit. Just, <laughs> no, no. And, and and I just realized that uh, the laptop froze, so it's all good. But uh, oh. yeah, that shit had me bugging because I'm looking at the screen and I'm like, <laughs> "That's not me." <laughs> <laughs> this shit is not. Me. <laughs> like, and my mind is really not here. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I'm not <laughs> and, and so uh, we'll edit th that. Yeah, I mean those technical difficult. I mean nobody sees this. I'm just mentioning it for. Uh, continuity purposes and go. people that know what's going on. We keep on. it real. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to edit this out. Esto se va a quedar. 
know? Yeah, I mean, uh, like, no it, one sees it, it, it. As long as it keeps working. Yeah, it's, it's going to. It adds character. And I'm going to figure out what's going on with well, that latency. Yeah. But all right, all good. Uh, today is someone that I'm excited to introduce in the respect of we crossed paths two years ago. It was two years ago. Now, yeah. yeah. Uh, at the Dominican Film Festival. And we had a very brief conversation, but because, man, I felt like I already knew you. And I'm glad oh that gosh. we've been able to reconnect. But uh, it was just really cool to hear someone that says, yo, I, I, I write comic books. I do movies. I do other shit. I'm like, wow. Shit. Um, tell me more. <laughs> 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 because, yo, you know, it, 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 the, we, I, I think we take for granted the the typecasting that we already are born into and, and all these things. And we, when someone shares a different position of, of what they're into, mm -hmm. it's like, oh, shit. So we're more than just this. Yeah, correct. Yeah. It's, yeah. Like, it's like, you don't have to stay in that lane. Like, or like nah, you don't, you show you yeah. no dance bachata on the weekends or do something? Like, <laughs> like, it's nah. sure you're not just yeah. smoking hookah. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, hey, something seems, yeah, yeah, something yeah. seems off. <laughs> A little yeah. off, yeah. It's see, oh, You're yeah. a little far from home. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. That's, yeah. that's exactly mm -hmm. it. <laughs> You're a little far uh -huh. from home. Yeah. I, like, I like that. It's yeah. like, where, where are you really from? Huh. Um, but today, you know, someone that I feel is not breaking the barriers, but creating the molds, and, and introducing um, more awareness into yo how much more we are. Mm -hmm. And and I'm appreciative and thank you for making the time to come through, our brother, my main man, Jeremiah Francois. Ooh, Ooh. Coño. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You got it right. You got it right. Wait, did I, I, did I, got it right. Yeah. Did, did? AKA my man Jay. No. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, we're gonna go with Jay. We're gonna go with Jay. <laughs> <laughs> but well, no, that was correct. That was correct. Oh, wow. Yo, almost sounds like a 007 name. Oh. It's really cool. Oh, it it can, it, you you got to say the whole thing. If yeah. you're not gonna say the whole nah, thing, nah, don't say nah, anything nah, at all. No, nah. no, nah, yeah. yeah. In, in high school, my teacher used to call me just Francois. Oh, yeah. Oh shit. And I used to be like, oh okay. And mm -hmm. one person called me Frankie. I was like, all right, I'm with it. I'm with it. I feel like that that kind of takes away from it the does. person. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It, it felt special because he was the only one that said it. He mm. knew it, so I was like, all right, I, I'll, I'll take that. that. Like that. Everybody else is Francois, motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> well, some respect on my name. <laughs> 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 I, I I do wonder, oh, shit. like, I, I I wonder the thought processes that people have when they name their children. Oh God! And oh, that could be a whole conversation. Oh, man. Yeah, especially that's a whole, that's especially whole our culture. That's a whole different ballgame. Dude, we talked about it before, right? How you spell your name? What 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 does it have? What the little, dash? The dash. Yeah. We, we, we don't even know what that. Dash. I don't even know what the dash is for. <laughs> you gotta do some research. Bro. I, gotta do some research. <laughs> I just looked at it. Oh fuck it! I'll take it. <laughs> I got no choice. The tilde, right? That's what it's called. The tilde. 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 I, say, I say it in oh. English. I don't dash. Know. Dash. Okay. I don't know. I mean, like, what do you call accent? Oh, you say accent. You right, can say yeah. accent. That's oh, like accent. encompasses all of them. Right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's like a little song. Because what is the little yeah, yeah, C? Yeah, yeah. So like the little C under my is called a sedia. Sedia. Yeah, but I say accent because people understand. Like, oh, okay, okay. something there. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. You, you, yeah. Ever seen that meme that says? Um, who the fuck says the whole alphabet in Spanish? Like, what is oh, a fucking oh. Y? Yeah. 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 No, it's I a fucking word. Yo, I just had a flashback to <laughs> high school. I remember I had to say the whole thing. I was y like, oh. What's Y again? Y wasn't there. Why? Oh, Y is yeah, yeah. why. That's right. That's right. Throw in double L. Double U. Double U. Double U. Double U. Double W. Yeah, double yeah, W. You know, but double L. There's a. Yeah. Oh, there's yeah. a double, yeah, yeah, double yeah, yeah, yeah. L in Spanish. The, the J. It makes that the comes J's. after the L. Yeah. Right? And then there's a CH. You got me there. The, oh. there's, yeah, there's a A, B, A, A, B, C, Ch. I mean, oh, I, like I there's a C H. Yeah, there's a C H. No, I don't remember. That, unless they didn't teach me that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. they skipped that one. <laughs> 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 like a, there, there's like a few extra shits in there yeah. that are like with two letters and shit. I don't know that. Well, I mean, the double O is the part double of it. Come yeah, back I didn't to that, but I didn't know there was a C H. There whatever. is, a, yeah. Che, so the ABC che. song is long in Spanish. Oh, much longer. <laughs> it's like, like, like thirty two letters. It's like a novela. It's like. Oh, they say, oh, wow. <laughs> but all that to ask, yes. like you know, I was uh, we were briefly exchanging um, the, the the origin of your name, mm. 
and and how that came about because you mentioned it you know so you're haitian but yeah. you you mentioned that the name is polish yes and yeah. i was like Como? Yeah. yeah yeah no it's funny so i think haitians their name's gonna have like haitian or french like backgrounds like my dad's name is jean or jean mm -hmm. so most haitians have either jean or uh, baptiste or bernard like you've you've heard those mm -hmm. like haitian names for those but some some guys i guess haitian old like old heads they like European names. So my dad. I saw, wonder why. Yeah, <laughs> right? uh, we wonder why. Yeah. Yeah. But when we say uh, like, do yeah. we yeah. mean strongly influenced? Oh, right. You talk so, about those nice people that came over on the boat many years ago and just kind of showed us the way of life, yeah, right? Yeah. Um, so he saw like the name on the newspaper. It was like a, a, a European prime minister. Uh, prime minister. Mm -hmm. He just liked the name. And then he was like, oh, I like that name. I'm going to name my son that. And I was like, I didn't, I, I never liked my name too. Because I remember growing up with the Michael Jordans, Michael Jackson. Oh, my stuff, God. Yeah. And then Will Smith. I'm yeah. like, yeah, why they got some like normal name? Yeah, why, 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 can, why can't I be Mike? Yeah, yeah like, yeah. Mike, Mike, like, Mike, 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 And yeah, I never liked my name first or last. Because I was just, I felt like the odd one out. And I was like, uh. Story of my life. Yeah. And then, and then like my cousins, uh, because, and that's another thing. So they like European names or Russian names. So I have like one of my cousin's name is like Dimitri or Vladimir. Vladimir. Like it, cool, yeah. yeah. So it's like they, depending on what, like because you have to be well read too. So they like that stuff. So I like well that. read. It's huh. yeah. a nice way of putting uh, it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, uh, <laughs> I've never come across uh, Dim uh, Haitian Dimitri. But nah. I'm You're glad that I've learned this now. <laughs> Dominican Vladimir's. I, you know what? But oh, the thing is, yeah, I, think yeah. I, I never. Yeah. In, uh, until you just mentioned it right now, it never it never clicked. clicked. Yeah, right. but I, because I'm like Vladimir. See, yeah. Vladimir. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, yeah. It. That's it. Vladi. Yeah. Yeah. No, because like, and there's like, I know. So my wife is Dominican, and then like I know in certain Dominican so Dominican households, I guess, mm -hmm. like some names are like Middle Eastern, like Ame. Or, oh yeah, yeah. Uh, what's another one? Uh, like Lebanese people, there there's a, a mix of Lebanese yeah, and Dominicans. Exactly. And yeah. So like it's just like I don't know. I would have to go into my history memory. <laughs> of like, like I didn't sign up for this shit. Yeah, <laughs> like, at that point, it's like something happened when they crossed over. Yeah, yeah. So, but it's there. I was like, okay, that makes sense. Huh? Mm. Yeah, I know. So I, I mean, all that to share and ask. Uh, you know, I, I was genuinely curious. So, you know, how did your pops go about choosing the name? Yeah. But yeah, you know, reading the newspaper. Yeah. I'm like, Mira. Yeah. Mira me gusta. That is yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. It's, it's that simple. <laughs> that simple. Yeah, that, it's funny, that beats mine. Like mine, I'm, my first name is Ramirito. The whole is, that, is that a combination? It's, a combination, it's Ramiro Jr., oh. basically, essentially. But it was like... They're like, what? My dad, they told him, like, oh, why do you name him Ramiro? I'm like, no, Ramiro soy yo. <laughs> He's like, yo soy Ramiro. That's Ramirito. I'm like. So your birth certificate says Ramirito? Ramirito, <laughs> bro. Get the fuck out Dude, of here. Dude, to this day, I swear to God, the other day I had a doctor's appointment, I had to draw blood, and she was like, Ramirito. Oh, shit. Yeah. I was like, yeah, that's right. She's like, Like, it's in your birth certificate. It's my legit name, Ramirito. Oh, shit. That shit sounds like a junior, right? Yeah, yeah. It sounds like a junior. But in Spanish, it's like it forces you to be junior. Yeah. Oh, exactly, it, is. it forces it is. you yeah, yeah. to be junior. And when I was wow. younger, I was joked as a kid, like uh, when I get older, so I'm like, oh, man, Don Ramirito, okay? Yeah. 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 The little thing, like, uh, big, but so little, Ramirito. Uh, no. that, that's why I couldn't be six feet. It doesn't doesn't match. I couldn't be uh, your height and be yeah. Ramirito. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it just wouldn't work. Like, it's just like. <laughs> that shit definitely wouldn't work. Yeah. Right? Just drinking milk. Just yeah. get, yeah. get taller. <laughs> like, nah. Oh, nah because you're a junior, too, Dre. Uh, but really, my father's name is Jose. Jose Wait, what? Andres Gomez. No fucking way. Yeah. I just learned that right. Yeah. 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 Hey, you don't know, know your uncle's name. All this time. You never know That's that so... fucking my father's name was Jose. I thought that was his middle name. No, it's opposite. Nigga, what? He doesn't look like I'm Jose. not really like, like, that's so weird. Yeah, yeah, like, you weird. just messed up his whole life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's my fucking cousin. We know each other. Since. So you never word? do that? Damn. I <laughs> thought his name was Andre Jose. Yeah, well, we're Gomez. breaking. Now you got me fucked up. I might be wrong. <laughs> I am pretty no, sure, no, Jose, bro. Jose Andres Gomez. You're fucking yeah. lying. I Yo, swear. Let's use the lifeline. Get him on the phone. I, I, know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I hope so. I hope so. <laughs> Yo, I'm a fucking fat 
Yo, yo. I fact check. I'm texting I'm not gonna, the family chat. Not right now. Not right now, now. But fact check it, yeah. Don't put him on blast. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's gonna know. Yo, bro, you're gonna call him like, hey, look at that thing in my name, bring it to radio. Look at that pasado, bro. Yeah. Oh, I had to say, yo, your fucking name is triggering a whole yeah. family yeah. tree. Oh, God damn, oh. we got like, what, 15 minutes or something? Oh, okay. yeah. Yo. <laughs> My bad. Uh, yeah, let's, yeah. Let's, let's get into it. it. Let's get into the guest. No <laughs> true, very true, very true. Uh, <laughs> yo, um, so you, you know what's wild? I was reviewing your work, and mm. outside of it being really dope, mm. I was genuinely, it, 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 you know, because... Rams, Ramirito. <laughs> no, you don't go by that though. Right? Yeah. Just, 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 just be a Ram, right? That's just all right. That's it. <laughs> that's, that's it. Yo, he uh, he walked in. He's like, yo, it fucked me up. I was reading the first comic book, the, the uh, my that, brother Teddy. Mm -hmm. and he's like, the fuck was I reading? There was no words. <laughs> and it, but the thing is, you know, it's wild that you expressed that, mm -hmm. right? And I didn't say it then because I wanted to save it for the the, the, the show right now. I said, huh, although it had no literal words, mm. that's the one that spoke the most to me. Well, mm. it was easy to follow. I mean, I mean, and it was, I liked it. I enjoyed it a lot, but it was just weird to me because it always, it's always just all the comic books, all the, all three of them that I've seen. <laughs> mm. I was always talking about it now. We're not, Dre and I, we're not big comic yeah. book guys mm. by any means, but uh, I found it very interesting. It was good. It was good. But go, go ahead. I just want to say, you don't say I liked it. You know, you made it sound. So you're supposed like, oh. to like use your imagination to put the words in the comics? I guess well, now that we have the writer here, there you go. Go. I was like, what? Yes. I'm like, look, yeah, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. like yeah. you look at the pictures and and talk for the character. Is that the whole point of it? Yeah, what was know. the premise behind? Yeah, yeah. No, I know. Uh, so I'm gonna take it back. Okay, right, so good. yeah, you know, we started. Oh my bad. Yeah, is, is that a good point? Is that no, a good no, place yeah, to yeah. start? Okay, yeah, yeah that's good. Too. Yeah, so that's my first like work and first published work. Mm. So. Like, so I had that. Oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the audience is sleeping. What's up? Wake up, wake up. <laughs> wake up, <the> sunny. <laughs> um, so the idea was, it has been in my head since college. So I'm 31. I graduated in 2015. So I'm like putting my age out there, right? Mm -hmm. um, I'm 31. No, I am 31. I'm going to turn 32 this year. <laughs> so I had the idea because I saw this picture of like uh, a teddy bear sitting on top of a boy, right? Mm -hmm. And protecting, because uh, he's sleeping and he's protecting the kid from a monster. I was like, oh, that's a dope idea. I'm going to remember that. So then like years later, 2020 hit, you know, COVID mm -hmm. and whatever. Uh, uh, my best friend who he moved and I was like, damn, I got in my feelings. And I was like, you know, you know what? Let me just start writing. And I start writing the story. Handed it. I was. I reached out to this artist, which, by the way, I don't remember how I met him. I either found him through Tumblr or Instagram. Tumblr. Yeah. Yo, yo, I right, take it back, right? Hey, yo. And then I was just like, I was like, hey man, like, would you be able to work together? And he was like, nah, I can't. I don't have time. COVID hit. He was like, he hit me up. He was like, yo, I have time. Let's do this. And I was like, that shut up. That's that's yeah. Yeah. No, And I'm, I'm so appreciative. But like, I, you know, COVID is bittersweet for a lot of people. Um, like for me, it it was more sweet than bitter because I was able to like sit down and then actually work on my stuff but to now kind of fast forward into the actual book um i was working in my budget because i was working part-time so i was like oh, i don't have a lot of money so i was like let me try to like bring the story like more i guess truncated mm. so i was like all right let me just start writing so i don't like spend money so i was like spending money for this and then it was done and there was just no words. <laughs> it was just done. And then I remember I was like, yo, this there needs to be something more. So I don't know if you guys saw that mm -hmm. there is a soundtrack for it. Oh, oh shit. Well, I, I saw the QR code, but I didn't get to hear it. Okay, you're supposed to listen to it while you go through the book. Oh, okay. So, so that I didn't kinda, experience it the right way. Damn. And that's the key ah, word. That was fuck. the key word. I learned. I, I heard that. <laughs> yeah. Damn it. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. So, well, thanks for having me, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the contract is over. Yeah, 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 contract is over. The fucking <laughs> Reese. Damn. Uh, uh, so, nah, so like, I, I, li I finished it. I was like, I don't want it to just be a picture book. So then... I hit up my friends. I was like, yo, should I make a soundtrack for this? They're like, it's not a bad idea. And then if you remember like the good old days in the library, you had like the cassettes with the books. Yeah. I was like, I can't do that. So QR code was the way. Wow. So that's that's the it's also on like Spotify and Apple Music. If you like really like it, you can go through it. Dope though. 
So you scan the QR code, it tells you the pages, what yeah. the song is for, and you just listen through it. So the keyword, you said experience. Yeah. So I was at a convention. They were like, yo, it's an experience. I was like, why didn't I think of that? It's an experience. So you don't read it. Oh, oh shit. That's dope. It. All right, yeah. now I got to go through it again. Because yeah. anyone could right just way. flip through it. It's yeah. like two minutes. You're just like, oh, okay, correct, whatever. Correct. But yeah. Ah, now we know. Now you, yeah. now the listeners know too. Now it's like, all right, right. you know how to do it. QR code. Um, well, I fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I was like, damn. <laughs> but, no, but, but like you said, that's how it works. You have the artist here to tell you exactly how, yeah. to, how to do that. And I'm, so, uh, I'm really happy about that. Yeah, that I'm very happy no, about. But you, like, you oh, revisit it, right? Yeah. yeah. yeah you'll, it'll be a different feeling. It'll be a different experience. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I've had people t- like... <laughs> oh, shit, I got it. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, keep throwing it in my face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> yeah. Nah, yeah. Like, people have told me like, yo, like, I cried. I was like... I felt some type of way because, like, I get this, like, imposter syndrome. I was like, I'm not a good writer. I can't make people cry. (laughs) But, like, people, I've had multiple people tell me they cried. I've had people wrote a letter through the publishing company, sent it to me. I was like, oh, shit. Like, yeah, move them. I moved emotions. Yeah. yeah. So the music you make? Oh, I didn't make it. No. I I hired someone. Uh, Her name is uh, Lauren Brianna Ware. She lives in Wisconsin. So she composed it. Oh, wow. All original music. Oh, dope. Shit. Yeah. Uh-huh. So I wanna now I need Yeah, yeah, that. definitely. Mm-hmm. I feel like it's the part of the show. Like, oh, we're gonna take a quick break. We're gonna, <laughs> go, we're gonna go watch this, and then Yo, just cut to all yeah, of us. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh wow. What what was your uh to to even go further back and mm-hmm. and you know before we continue to to your more recent work, what was your um original inspiration to even go in this direction? And oh, and, bro, like the cartoons growing up, like yeah. the nineties, like. Static Shock. I can Damn, name a lot of shows. Yeah, 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 we yeah, could yeah, take it back. back. Barney. <laughs> Sesame yeah. Street. Um, it's super, you know, all the cartoons we grew up with. And then I just always liked watching TV. And you know how our parents are. They're like, yo, can't be watching TV, blah, blah, blah. Oh, like, no, nah, I, I like storytelling. And that's the mm. thing. And, you know, I am doing kind of like this um, revisiting my, I guess, like ancestry. Like when I look back, like, like, I know I'm Haitian, but when you look at, obviously, we were talking about joking before, yeah. like, how we came here. But <laughs> <laughs> but when I look at, like, I did, uh, what's it called? Not 23andMe. What's the other one? A- Ancestry? Or what yes. yes. Ancestry. I think that's from. the one I did. So I refuse to give 100 bucks to know where uh, I, just, I got stolen I, from. I, I, yeah, <laughs> my, 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 my brother. Yeah, right, that was yeah. Yeah. So oh I gave them half. <laughs> I gave them half. I used the God coupon. Yeah. Yeah. I waited until I got the code. The coupon. I'm like, y'all motherfuckers already <laughs> took me. Yeah, yeah, gonna take my money, money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck y'all. Uh, yeah, fuck yeah. Y'all. <laughs> my brother did it, so I just took his, his results until I got better. We good. There we go. Yeah, yeah, did it. Wait, did wait, it. Wait, wait, my nigga told it. me, yo, we come from Africa. I'm yeah. like, what? Yeah, right. <laughs> I was like, oh, shit. Why I'm didn't like, you give me the fucking $100? <laughs> I could have told you that shit. Yeah, for real. Yo. I would have charged you 75 Yeah. yeah. He's, He's like, nah, but there's like a mix of pork chicken. My man, I am fully aware. You know, of the rebranded transatlantic uh, trade. That's yeah. what they called uh, it. Because yeah. uh, yeah, uh, when I was in school, it was called the slave trade. Uh-huh. Yeah. And I'm like, okay, thank you for the transparency. Yeah, right? <laughs> now, now they're trying to be political. With yeah, now, now. now it's the, the, the transatlantic... Um, it has a nicer name. Cruise? <laughs> <laughs> the transatlantic cruise? They had a great view. Yeah, they had billboards <laughs> up and everything. Uh, like, oh, it looks nice. Wait, who the fuck went through this whole rebranding yeah, yeah, process yeah. for this shit? Yo, yeah. that's, that's, that's human trafficking. Yeah, right? yeah. yeah. That's what we pay them for. We pay the government to just rebrand everything. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So make it sound nicer. Like, make it nicer that way. Yeah. It's like AI. Yeah. Like, yeah. Make this sound nicer. nicer right? yeah. Yeah. Transatlantic cruise. <laughs> 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 so you want. Uh, so, so you you're learning more about the yes. ancestry. No, yeah, like so I'm like thinking back like where like the my roots go back and most of our roots are similar. Um I forget exactly. It was in somewhere in West Africa. Like a lot of people there were storytellers. And then I'm like, I'm sure a lot of us that came from Africa are storytellers. Obviously beyond that, but I always wanted to tell stories. Um and it kind of clicked when I was in like sixth grade. I was like yeah, I really like this. Hmm. I remember seeing a script and I was like, oh, this is dope. Like, person's name, what they say. Like, that's cool <laughs> to see. And then yeah. when you see it come to life and you would know, like, right? Like, seeing it come to life and then you get this, like, this feeling. I can't even explain what the feeling is. Like, it's ineffable, but it's just, damn, like, it's it feels good. It's dope. Good. It's dope. Yeah. yeah. It just feels good. It's, 
And then, you know, I'm kind of going off tangent. That's one thing I do on my show. <laughs> yeah, go, off tangent. go ahead, go ahead. Drop the plug. What's the name no. of the show? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, yeah, I do have a podcast called The Average Jays. So, me, I'm the, the Irish J. No, the Average Oh, average. I'm like, <laughs> wait, what? Like, like an average Joe. Gotcha. Um, so, yeah, average like. Average Jays. We talked about, you know that movie, um, the Pixar movie with. Uh, Wow, why am I forgetting the movie? The black dude that plays piano. Why? So, so, thank so. One of the best fucking Yo, Pixar movies ever. Bro. That love that, love that yeah. fucking movie. Love that movie. One of the things they mentioned is about going in the zone. Mm. Like, yes. playing mm. basketball, yeah, yeah, baseball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like, when you're writing the thing and you're just like, oh, dropping freaking gems. Yeah, and then yeah. it's just like, yes, that's Bars. it. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly Bars. that. <laughs> so, it, it was, it's a good feeling. And then I just wanted to do it. Just wanted to keep writing. And I want to... I don't want to look to be like, obviously everyone says this, but like, I don't want to be like super rich, I'm, but I want to be like, I want to have time and money just to like daydream mm. and just right. not have to work for, for like, you know, companies or whatever. Yeah. But yeah. Shit. Yeah. I, I, I do. I never verbalized it that way, but yeah, you're right. I want to kind of fucking just daydream. Dude, that, that, that's an awesome way to <laughs> put it. That's where ideas come from. Yeah. Fine. So ideas come from. money to daydream. Yeah, because that, we, used to, we used to do that yeah. in school. Like, we, like they, you would get in trouble for, like, looking out the yeah, window. Yeah, or yeah, like, yeah, yeah. And it's like, yeah. nah, I'm done with You're my work. Out, yeah. Now I want to space, yeah, space out. Space the yeah. fuck out. <laughs> I'm done Happy with this thoughts. bullshit. Yeah, like, <laughs> I already know what two plus two yeah. is. It's like... <laughs> So I'm gonna use this quadratic equation. Yeah, I was just sometime. gonna say, like, <laughs> I know pi. One, one time uh, in life, it's gonna like. <laughs> there be times to be saving me though when I would like I start doing the math and I'm like a plus b plus. C oh yeah, the Pythagorean theorem. Pythagorean yeah, theorem. Oh, God, theorem. Yeah. I was yeah. like, that's how we got the triangle. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, I still don't know why the fuck I know what a parallelogram is Ooh. or a rhombus. But it's a in rhombus. there. Like fuck all that. I, I, I still don't know what a W two is. Let me see. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> no, like what? Me. What does W two even stand for? I, oh, that, yeah, I, I can't tell you that yeah. though. I know what it is. I just don't. Want to, I don't know what it is. <laughs> Nobody no. knows a W stands for. I don't know what the fuck. Let's get ten eighty. Fuck out of here. Anyway, <laughs> why that number? Like, right? like yeah. it's so weird. Why do you have W one? It's to confuse us. It's to confuse us. W1 uh, was no good. W2, yeah. that's the one. <laughs> nah, but you know what would have been funny? Yeah. If it would have been F2. F U. <laughs> now we understand, no, motherfucker. No. True. Very you true. put the F U at the top of the paper. Uh -huh. and let me find my F U because the whole you doing is fucking. Put your tin hats this. on. <laughs> if you change the W, it's probably going to make an F U. Yeah, yeah. yeah. F U. That's go. it. Let's no. do it man. that way. Please <laughs> keep it honest, government, and just put the F U and we will understand. We will understand. Oh, man. Uh, my, my, my apologies for so many of the random tangents because yeah. uh, but as I shared mm -hmm. when we did cross paths I was like yo I felt that there was um, just like yo I know you we cool and let's let's keep it moving and a very organic connection because um, at that at that time you were sh uh, showing your film The Cycle right yes that's yeah right. and um, I, I, I believe I'm pretty sure I, I did watch it because it was on the same block as ours um and there was a whole it, it, but it, two years ago so i'm refreshing yeah. my memory off now but it was a an entire dialogue of two brothers talking mm -hmm. and what was their exchange remind me again um so yeah it was so i wrote the i wrote the script it was my my director slash cinematographer's story mm. um it was about uh two you know two brothers two cl no not brothers but they're friends but they're my bad very i call close. everybody brothers. no 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 yeah and uh, just to clarify they're they're best like they're close friends well if you guys watching the video, I'm doing air quotes. <laughs> uh, so, and minor spoilers, but yeah, they're, they link up and one of them is confiding in him. He's like, Hey, yo, my girl's like, yes. I, don't know, I think she's like cheating on me. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and it's kind of the toxic masculinity, toxic masculinity part of the story where the friend is like, ah, fuck that bitch. Blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. And he's like, kind of like, if you remember the, Othello story is I kind of do the like leaning in the ear because you're whispering this evil in mm -hmm. his ear. He's like, "Yo, fuck her, like whatever, do your thing." Come and find out, he's the one. Smash that ah, yeah. So it's just like it, it's it's messed up, but like you have to go there to write that story. Like I never done that, but I mean, like you have to go <laughs> yeah, in that yeah, space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope you got the guy whispering in the guy's ear. Hey, <laughs> fuck her. I, I, her. Yeah. 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 I can't. Yeah, I know that, but. Damn. Yeah. Th thank you for giving us the benefit of the doubt of um, thinking that we read Othello. <laughs> 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 
I don't know. I don't, yo, yeah. I only like that story a lot because of Lawrence Fishburne. Because I seen the movie and I was like, it's Lawrence. That's that's uh, Morpheus right there. Yeah. Shit. Ha. Yeah, I do remember that. And, and also, I remember uh, this guy, uh, Mackay Pfeiffer. He played uh, a version. It was called O. Yes. I, I didn't. I don't know. remember that movie as obviously the same story. Yeah. But yeah, I don't remember the movie a, a lot. But yes. I and uh, I, so. I, I'm all that to say I never read the fucking story but, That's all good. <laughs> but I, I got the gist of yes. it from watching mm-hmm. clips of a film I'm like mm-hmm. I don't need to see white people fucking <laughs> <like that. laughs> but uh, <laughs> white people problems yeah <laughs> <laughs> oh well, well, what I remember about that uh, that short as well was just mm. uh, different places that you guys shot so I just saw you guys were by the reservoir for one like Central Park I, you know what's what crazy it? I was even there oh, oh okay. I was never there my, so quick story I wrote this I wrote the script gave it back to my friend I was like yo here's the script he was like yo this is really good yeah. like yo what kind of fucked up shit is yeah. <laughs> and then I didn't know we were gonna do a festival this was a year before mm. and then he hits me around he's like yo we got in I was like got in what he's like <laughs> oh the Dominican Film Festival I was like you didn't tell me you were gonna do this. Yeah. I thought we were just doing it just to do it. Mm. And then I was like, okay, but I wasn't there. He was by oh, okay. somewhere. That so, was a good surprise. Yeah, yeah. Though. That's yeah. yeah. to make it to the to the festival yeah. was pretty Shout cool. out yeah. to the friend for being proactive. Fuck that yeah. word. Yeah. After it. hell yeah. yeah, just to shout him out, uh, Carlos Vasquez. Oh. Oh. Quez. Cilo. Put it in that. <laughs> put it in that work. Yeah. Um, wow. So, you know, in so to go from. Daydreaming in class <laughs> mm-hmm. to uh, wanting to become a writer, mm-hmm. getting into writing. So, do, in, in, did you immediately go into um, just the, the 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 comic book route, or was it just, or, or or that because that was your first published work you mentioned? Yeah. And in that was that the best. Let me think about how I want to ask this question. Mm. Um, how, why not like novel writing? Why not go in that direction? I, I definitely want to write a book, but it's just like I feel like that that in itself that would have worked back in the day. <laughs> like like if this was like if I was not black and <laughs> back in the 1800s yeah. writing a book anyone could do that and it it like that probably can sell and get the message out. But now like I kind of spoiler. I want to be a, a director writer at the end. That's like my goal in life. Mm. But when I start, so I graduated in 2015, and then I hooked up with one of my boys to do like some sort of cartoon, and and because I hit him up because we went to the same high school. We went to a Cardinal Hayes in the Bronx. Oh shit! Because Cardinal oh, Hayes, my Yo, brother went to there. See another Bronx tale. See, yeah. you know, we out here. My brother, my brother went to Cardinal. Oh, oh yeah. But I got a, I got a rep at Washington Heights because I was born and raised. There you go. Uh, so, <laughs> Uh, so, sorry, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> but no, yeah, we, we we linked up, and he was like, "Yo, man," because he was doing his own thing. If you guys know about the Bronx Native, that's like his like project. Mm. But before that, he didn't have a shop, so we were just trying. He was doing a lot of like wedding videos and all that stuff, and he was like, "Yo, let's create a cartoon." So that's when I was like, "Yo, I got I'm, I have nothing to do after college." I was working as a doorman. I was like, "Yo, here's a script. Here's a script." Mm. So that was like like pulling teeth with him like it just wasn't working out but like the idea stayed in my head and then i kind of forgot the question like i'm kind of going to, <laughs> why did you go the comic book route? oh yeah oh, so yeah. yeah so thank you <laughs> so like yeah fast forward yo, so like oh speaking of so i was i was working as a doorman i would sit down right on my notebook i carry the notebook all the time with me it's always in here hmm, so like i always for, for our listeners oh yes my man has a uh, whole backpack uh, with him yeah. yeah so the notebooks it's, in it's there. just my notebook and my comic books that i've written like i just keep them with me so like it's random weird like it's a weird thing but like well, you some, never know just you, in case like if something happened to me like my stuff is with me you'd be you know surprised what, I mean? what a weird, people carry hmm. in their book bags so no no I wouldn't yeah, no. that's not even weird I don't find that's it normal. weird I don't find it weird but it's just like my like it's a what's the word it's a weird fear like if something happened to me I don't have my stuff so it's like I'd rather be with oh. my stuff but if something happened to you like how like if you got kidnapped or something I'm not like, kidnapped oh, <laughs> no, like, no, like not to be gloomy but yeah. it's like if I like got killed and I'm just there like I have my stuff like I just have it with me so gotcha. like I just want like because the thing at the end of the day like I'm so happy that my brother Teddy exists because mm-hmm. I'm like if I leave that stays here mm. and anyone can read it so that's, I just want like people true. to know that's my stuff but that's that, that's just a, like a weird thing but yeah. anyway uh, no, 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 it's a proud, no, it's a proud, it's a proud I, thing. No, and I understand that. about your work. Yeah, because even yeah. in your works, I feel like you almost mm. become immortal in that way. Even though you're not here, it's like no matter what, people can still revisit yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's the goal. And then, so yeah, I like, um, I've been writing all my stuff. And then I started working at Apple part time. So with, it's not like a set schedule. So mm -hmm. I'm just like, oh, I'm trying to do like shorts. So like my boy, Carlos was like challenging me to like uh, film shorts. So he mm -hmm. was like, yo, choose a prop, choose a location, shoot it. And that's I it. had like a fake uh, katana. Uh, he was like, I want to, I was like, I want to shoot uh, here, here and here. And I just did it. And then he was like, all right, let's do it. He's like, so you, on YouTube, I have all my videos that I've shot. So you can understand like the writing, the filming, the the dialogue. And you can see the progression of me getting better, but that's taking too long. Mm. And then trying to shoot or even do animation, it's just so time consuming, especially when you work part time. You know, mm. after college, you just, you need money. Yeah. And <laughs> like, that says, and yo, and that says a lot yeah. because. Yo, Biden with the loans, bro? Come on. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Taking mad long over here. But Still haven't gotten that fucking email. No, no. <laughs> Waiting. But, yeah, so, like, I think it was in, so it was 2020. So I've been working at Apple since 2017. And then it just, I kept telling people, like, yeah, I'm working on a comic book. I'm working on a comic book. I'm working on something. Like, I haven't had anything to show. Mm. And then that was in 2020 when I finally got it. I was like, yeah, I realized, oh, I could just do comics. Because I've always wanted to do comics, but I didn't think I could get in. Because, you know, when you think comics, you think DC, Marvel, mm -hmm. Image, IDW. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, yeah, I can't get into that. Writers are usually like, you know, lawyers. Uh, they work in the CIA. Like, they have writing credentials. Or they've, yeah, yeah. Or, or they've written books like uh, yeah. Tanahashi Coates. Like, it's one of those things where, like, they get the in where someone like me... And I always said in my head, which I I don't say now, but I used to be like, yo, I'm a nobody. I'm from the Heights. No one really, really knows the Heights like that. So why would they give me a chance? And then 2020, you realize I do my thing. I find like other peers like me online that are just like me doing indie stuff. Mm. And indie's on the rise. Mm -hmm. So it's like, okay, like I can do this. So maybe if someone takes notice of my work, I probably could write a Batman comic here or whatever. But... I have to do the work. So then when I started right. doing comics, it's like, okay, that, at least I'm exercising my skill. I'm just like, all right, I'm doing this, I'm doing this. And then it's until recently I started going to, like, conventions. So I was like, okay, now I get to see more people. <clears throat> so, yeah, that's why I went to comic books. Mm. I started focusing on there. Hopefully one day I can do, like, more movies and stuff yeah, like no, that. Yeah, no, dude, that's, that's, that's dope, the goal. Man. That's an yeah. awesome path, too. Because yeah. it's easier. Because I can just hire the artist, they do the work, yeah. and I don't have to be there. Gotcha. So, yeah. Sure. Dude, I mean, that's and even so, the same way you said you wrote the script and then the script is handed over, and I'm like, mm -hmm. oh, this scene. They're like, yeah, they they did that. They, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. It's pretty cool. I pretty mean, cool, man. It sounds very streamlined. You got this shit put together <laughs> for a dude. Yeah. That, for a dude that's like, pero yo no sé. I don't know. <laughs> if I should. Huh. So, oh, so some of these, like the uh, the artists that you found, like the uh, illustrator and things like that, you yeah. found them off of. So, so his name is Todor. So he's from Bulgaria. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Which is, which is funny because if uh, 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 I did not expect that, yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> um, is, is your part of Queens called Bulgaria? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> from Bulgaria, Queens, Queens. <laughs> Bulgaria, Queens. <laughs> that, that seems more. Uh, yeah, 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 that seems more right. the better part. Okay, right. That yeah. sounds real. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I found out, I I, I want to say Instagram, but I don't remember how I came across him. But yeah, we 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 work together. And he's been doing his work. His work is great, as you see yeah. from my brother Teddy. But yeah. his work has improved significantly. Because wow. he, if you guys like Stranger Things, mm -hmm. he draws the comics for Dark Horse Comics in um, for that s series. I think it's the prequel to Stranger Things. Oh, shit. Wow. Yeah, so, like, that's all him. Yeah. And his, like, he gave me a, uh, recently, like, last week or this week, he gave me the cover to one of the uh, variants to one of my comics. Mm. So I was like, dude, this looks way like, yo, yeah. I was like, you're in the hyperbolic time chamber. <laughs> yeah. You've been practicing Holy this whole time. Yeah. And I'll show you guys off air because I know we're like recording. Yeah. But like, it was really dope. And yeah, and I we're still in contact. Um, and then the color is because it's a different person. There's different. Okay. So you got the inker. There's there's a. There's a penciler, there's an inker, and then there's a colorist. Jeez. But, oh, whoa. But well, to, <laughs> for Toter, yeah. Yeah, no, yeah. yeah. So yeah. Toter does the inking and penciling. So that's all one package. And then uh, I worked with the colorist, Sonia, also from Bulgaria. Their, their community is pretty small. They, like, they all know each other. So then she did the coloring. And then when I started moved on to my next book, she was like, yo, is there anyone you want to reach out to to do your other comic? 
And he's like, oh, you can talk to this person. I was like, oh, yeah, like, let me let me talk to him. So I was talking to this guy named Constantine. Mm. Dope ass name, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, but that's the actual yeah, name. Know, right? I know somebody yeah. named Constantine, yeah. too, though. He's on his yeah. birth certificate? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, know, I know somebody like yeah, that. Yeah. Bring the proof. Yeah, he's yeah. really dope. And then we started talking. We started hashing out, like, the ideas for the comic. And he's like, yeah, you know, Sonia's my wife. And I was like, bro, oh, this damn. is a team right damn. there. <laughs> so, like, she does the coloring. I was like, yeah, her colors are great. So I'm like, I don't no one does colors i like she's the only one i would go to for colors because i'm like wow. she would i'm like i have a team yeah. So that, yeah like that just happened and this was the start of 2020 like and we're in 2024 right yeah. now so yeah. and still go and that's the funny part right because i mean obviously you guys I, I, safe to say you guys never met in person because of the distance yeah. and all that but yeah. still work together it's and crazy how you gels. think about it that's like, crazy yeah, years like, ago we would that would never happen no like nah, that, nah, hell no that would no. never happen nah. Nah, hell no so so when nah. you when you create your characters and all that do you give them ideas like yo this is how i want them to look or you just tell them yo do you um, no, I'll tell them like, yo, this is what they'll like. They'll do the concept art for the character. I'm like, I, I want him to wear this. I want the color of the hair. I was like, I'll do that. And whatever you want to add, you do it. Okay. And yeah, but like if, um, yo, can, let me take it back to like Todor, how I had, I can I kind of give a birthday present to myself. So I'm a big Ninja Turtles fan. I love Ninja Turtles. <laughs> <laughs> Which one's your favorite though? Leonardo. Oh, cool. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Did you read the uh, last Ronin? Yo, that's, that's, that's a silly question, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. So, I, a lot of people are like, "Oh, you're you're whack. You like the op." I'm like, "No, but like, first of all, I like Leonardo because I like swords. Katana's like really cool. Mm -hmm. But then he's also like, like I don't see myself as a Raphael because Raphael's a more popular character because he's like he was red. Mm -hmm. yeah, 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 yeah. I'm like, no, and I like all of them equally. But I'm like, I lean towards. I don't know. Raphael was the most popular one. He is a, him, oh, yeah. him and Mikey. Really? Yeah, yeah. I could see Mike. I would have thought Mike would have been the more popular one. And then uh, Donatello's probably the least one, right? Yeah. In a sense. Like, my cousin, he likes Donatello, but I would see him more as a raft. I but... thought Leonardo was the fucking popular that, one. That's yeah. what I would have thought, too. Blue and yeah, yeah. The, swords. the swords. That's what I thought, too. If, if you were to take it back to people older than us, they grew up with, they didn't have the colored uh, Ninja Turtles. They all wore the same red. What? Yeah, it was black and white, but they all had red. Right. Yes. You just fuck with them. Holy oh, shit. Oh, I, they even, I, I never knew that. Yeah. No. Oh, they all wore one color at uh, one point? Were, yeah, you only could tell who they were by their weapons. Oh, shit. So if you're reading it, you will be like, oh, that's Don't Tell. That. Yeah, you Get the okay. fuck out of here. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> but, but again, we're not into comics. We're, we're that's just, right. Like, I, I used like, to watch the cartoons. Yeah, I, I yeah watch and the that's, cartoons. Why, that's yeah. where you got the colors from. Yeah. Um, but they only did that so you can differentiate. And mind you, kids are watching it, so yeah. they're like, they want you to be like, yeah. I'm the red one. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're right, so, you're right, right. Yeah, like Power Rangers. Yeah. So what was the present? Uh, what? You oh, you 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 oh yeah, the it was the present. I was like, I was like, what? I told him, you got lost in the Ninja Turtle world. It became you. I'm like, not here anymore. He's like, is it present? What were you? Oh, you brought gifts. What are you talking about? What happened? You was talking about it. Yeah. Nah, so um, oh, yeah. no, like I, so it was 2017. So like that was the that was a definitive year. Actually, I was like super depressed. My mom got sick, and she thank God she's still alive with with us yeah. right now. Um, I, I don't know if the applause is the yeah. appropriate. No, no, thing, it is appropriate. I'm happy. Yeah. I'm happy thank God she's okay now. Yeah. What, what was if you don't mind me asking? Oh, uh, yeah, I don't what mind was she asking. going through? She so in during college she was always going to like doctors or whatever mm. and stuff like that and. Then it was like right after you, she had uh, kidney failures. Oh shit! Oh. Yeah. So then it's one of those things where people—I don't want to say people of color, people in like our neighborhoods or anything like that—a lot of kids experience that because you know we don't get a lot of good health care. No, you know no. where we live. No. No. So, yeah, yeah. And we don't yeah, eat good and no. all that it's, type it's, of shit. Yeah. Yeah, but like, it, it also could be part of the genetics. But it's just like it's just the way things are. So like, she got sick and then she had to go through dialysis. So like, mm. dialysis is like really tough. It is. And at the same time, which it's weird, things come full circle. So my wife now was like a girl I was seeing then, but she was going through her own thing. So I didn't see, like, we didn't like break up because we weren't together for that long. But we started seeing each other, but she's like, oh, I can't do this. So I got more depressed. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. So oh, like, fuck. were you like, the side guy at the time? I guess no, I was the side guy. I was like, I was like, I guess. Yeah. 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 home. Yeah. 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 My mind is split because I was like, damn, mm. like I was really digging this trick. And then I'm, then my mom is getting sick. So like I had this crazy dream where like my world was falling apart. Like, mm. It was like one of those things. So like as I'm like starting to feel better and like I had, I started writing Ninja Turtles first. This was before my Napoleon comic book. So mm. I was like, let me just write a script for this. And I just wrote like six issues. 
And then that's when I met Toto. I was like, yo, can you draw these characters in this way? And he nailed it. They're like things that, like to answer your question mm -hmm. before, I was like, I want them to look like this, but add whatever you want. So like for uh, Donatello, he's like in a roof, he's looking in the computer. Dude adds Converse on uh, Donatello, but like cut out, like ninja shoes. Oh, yeah, yeah. And I was like, I would not have thought of that. Yeah, like dope. that was really dope. Yeah, yeah. I was that's, like, that's, that's really stylish. It's right? stuff, yeah, it's yeah. stuff yeah. like that was dope. He gave like an... Um, I wanted to have like Raf Raphael like in a UFC like octagon thing, but he mm -hmm. gave him like these like like cargo pants. I was like, yo, I didn't even yeah. I mm -hmm. would never have thought of that. It's stuff like that. I was like, yo, just run with because I don't like to control that. Yeah. yeah, I was like, this is what I want, Free but range. do whatever you want because I don't want to. Like, I think that is a good director in yeah. a sense when like that's the thing like you you build trust you build a relationship and you just don't be controlling like ridley scott yes i'm shouting <laughs> <my name. laughs> I, I hear ridley yeah. scott is crazy but he knows his stuff but yeah. whatever but yeah so wait what was the gift it was just i i, I paid to do mm. those things for myself so i was just like i wanted to have those pictures got it so uh, it's just do you I, have them with you i want to see them what the fuck? uh yeah they're on my phone actually oh, okay. i can okay. like i can bring and, it out right now but yeah and definitely yeah. send them to me so i can so um, upload mm -hmm. put them on the episode edit 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 <laughs> yeah edit. yeah i'll definitely show you them but like yeah it was really cool Damn. and i was just like super happy with it I'm so that, not, that that took you out to your the, help to take you out of your profession i'm guessing right? yeah so like that helped and i was like really i it got me hyped and then one oh, time shit. i was at work yeah you can like flip through as well there's like five pictures um and yeah, if you look at the whole thing, it's just a folder of all Ninja Turtles <laughs> stuff. So like that, that, those are the things I enjoy. The last one is Master Roshi. Yeah. Um, Not to control, have you no. kept writing things or have ideas? I for know. Turtles? So my goal is oh, shit. so yeah, my goal dope. is to one day I have the scripts. I wrote all six issues because yeah. they're not my characters to like write a. I Correct, could right, if I wanted, to, yeah, but yeah. I want it to be official. Like mm -hmm. I want to go to idw and be like yo i wrote Here a script and like that is a like, kind of a goal for me before like writer director mm -hmm. so like i want to like show that be able to have right? that story because yeah. i don't want it to be like a fan fiction where like oh it's just on the internet Correct. i could oh, do that yeah, but that's yeah. just a waste of money yeah where it is it is not it a lot of people are going to see it i want it to be official and then but then when he when uh kevin eastman wrote last ronin i was like damn like because i want to tell a story of them beyond being teenagers mm -hmm. so last ronin is in a sense that but i was like wow. my story i think is I don't want to say better, but I have a different yeah, take. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I think it's just better. a different take. Uh, different, different take. That's uh, the word. that's the key word. But yeah, so yeah, so there's no story that wow, they they sick. are o older, right? They're they all dead. Right? They, yeah. they all died. In in they're last in last this, Ronan, they're, they're all okay. dead. Wow. Except for one. In the first issue, you don't know who it is till the end of issue. One. Was it Super Shredder? Nah, it's fucking. It, it's, uh, <laughs> Super Shredder it's, was cool, yo. <laughs> spoiler alert. Yeah. yeah, Mikey. Mikey is the last one to stay alive. Mike Angel. Get the fuck out yeah. of here. Yeah. But All of them, I would have never thought him. No. And then the crazy thing is, like, if you if you do read into the comics, it's just like he is the like quote unquote like ditzy dumb one, but yeah. it's just because he's so aware with like his surroundings. That's why when you see him fight, he fights very freely. Ah. So like he. It is not surprising to me that he survived. Got you, got Wait, you, got you, got me, you. Me th re being, knowing that So stuff. definitely <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, so. Definitely. I, that's I used to think it was just a doofy motherfucker. That's what I mean, too. Yeah, yeah, that surprised yeah, the shit out of me. The way he just you. broke it down. Uh, he, he, he's really the end. most fluid. Yeah. yeah. Dad, yeah. Fuck. He's the most. He's water. He's water. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Like Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee. Yeah. Fuck. Because he doesn't He doesn't think a lot, but he his body moves. Fuck. Shout out to Michelangelo. But yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. If you, you ever, yo, he, if he read mind. it, you should you should read it. It's a, it's a good read. It's a good read. Apparently, these motherfuckers don't read. I'm saying yeah, <laughs> we don't. We don't comics. You, know, you want to know something? You want to know something funny Very though? True. In in my in my <laughs> podcast, um, we have a thing called the weekly wrap. So mm -hmm. it's whatever what whatever we are watching, reading, or playing. Mm -hmm. So I tend to be reading stuff. My friend never reads. So we say he's illiterate. <laughs> you know how to read, but you don't read. Yeah. So you're illiterate. <laughs> so sign me up. Uh, yeah. Sign me up. So Master Splinter, of course, dead too. Yeah, yeah. Every, everyone, everyone was everyone. Everyone died. Everyone died. Everyone died. Yeah. Is Shredder in it? Even even uh Casey, the the dude Casey with the Jones. House? Yeah, Casey. Yeah, yeah fucking Casey Jones. April, April. Obviously. April's just alive, but she's missing a leg and an arm. God damn, April. What the fuck fucking, happened? Wait, so so what happened? She must future, be mad. Old this, though. This the future. I don't. Oh, it, it's, it's pretty dope. I don't. Okay, all right. Yeah, 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 don't spoil it. All right, all right. But you should read it. Okay. So she's in a wheelchair. I'm in. So where do I start? I mean, you can just read that. Was it with the no, you could just read. Yeah, just that. Oh, you could just read that. Whatever the whole knowledge story. you know about Ninja Turtles, you read that, you'll get it. Okay, oh, I yeah, bet. Yeah, it's not cool. like you need to read fucking. Do they do? Do they still like pizza and? Uh, 
Nah, I think he's on some other shit. He's too, he's too serious. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. He's he on some real protein shit. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. He shops at Whole Foods now. And it's, 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 he said it's he's different. on Whole Foods. For an optimum <laughs> protein shake. Yeah. He said he's on Whole Foods. He drinks, he drinks matcha. He on a whole different level, bro. He on a whole different level. Fucking matcha. So Comic-Con, Comic-Con, do you attend every year? Nah, so I... It was what? 20, 2020, 2023 of the summer, I went to Tampa Bay Comic Con. That was my first convention. Awesome. Oh. So that one has 50,000 50, people that show up there. What? My best friend lives in Tampa, so I, I sent all my books down there, and then we went together to promote my stuff and promote the podcast. Nice. So that was another thing. We were trying to like push our podcast and my stuff out there. It was a good feeling. No expectations. We were nervous. I was like, oh, this is really dope. And then... Um, most recent podcast uh, podcast most recent convention was in february which is called megacon which is in orlando okay that one has 200k people damn yeah, yeah so whole, that, what that, arena is this that yeah but so many people, people. what fucking church well it's <laughs> no but think about it have you guys have you guys been to new york comic con no nah, no nah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah so the jacob javits yeah. so that megacon, need to read megacon, one, yeah i never I know. <laughs> nah, megacon is as big as new york comic con it's really bad. yeah megacon's been around since the 90s i've only heard about it in the last probably like 10 years but it not a lot of people know because a lot of like mainstream people probably say i don't say mainstream but people think that New York Comic Con is major. So it's New York Comic Con and it was a San, San Diego. Diego. Yeah. Those are the two people that, like, if I mention Comic Con, that's, that's the two yeah, they think about. Yep, exactly. But there are other conventions. Like, Didn't there's Dragon Con, there's Emerald City Con. Then there are conventions for little things. Like, Power Rangers has their own, like, convention. It's just oh, all shit. Power Rangers. What? Yeah, it's wild. Like, you, you'd be <laughs> surprised. When, if you look for it, you'll, they'll have conventions. I ain't gonna so, lie. I, I ran into the Black Ranger one time. Oh, Walter Jones? He yeah. was He was at both cons that I went to. And I got like a little, I didn't say nothing, so, but I got a little giddy. Yeah. 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 I was like, oh shit, the Black Ranger. Yeah. 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 It's weird because I, I like, look, it, it was in the street too. It yeah. wasn't like, it, mm. I, I didn't see him at a Comic Con, right? Oh, okay. Like, I saw him in the street, but it was during Comic Con time, so I'm mm. sure he was just, you know, roaming around or whatever. And I saw him and I was like, Black Ranger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, like, you, you just do one of those head yeah, nods. Yeah, yeah. And he was like, and he just acknowledged he's, it. He's, I don't know. You yeah. know what would have been funny if you did the, like, the. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been, he would have been like. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> the street. But if he did it back, though, that would have been dope. Yo, I mean, but no, I had no idea so, that they had their own com- damn, convention. word up. I didn't yeah. even know that yeah. either. So, so how was February? So th- February you, was amazing because that one, shout out to my wife, too. That, that was Orlando, was like, right? That was Orlando because. Mm-hmm. We, so that one was four days. So mm-hmm. like New York Comic Con is four days. So MegaCon was four four days. Thursday was like day one. Uh, great. I saw one of my favorite writers, Scott Snyder, who wrote, uh, if you know the Batman, yep. uh, Court of Owls. Mm-hmm. He was there. He was like 10 to 15 feet away from me, like his booth. So I've been following this dude for a minute. Wow. So like, what was it? Uh, 2011, like New 52, which is comic stuff common nerdy stuff the, okay. when they revamped all of them and started back at one yes. oh. uh, zero one uh, from like they said fuck yeah the whole I mean, that, that only lasted for five years so when i graduated college they ended and they kind of brought everything back but anyway so scott snyder was he was like the goat when it came to writing batman mm-hmm. and i remember reading and stuff i was like yo i love the writing i love this dude and the years ago, my boy Carlos went to a signing, which was in Barnes Noble. I couldn't go because I was at work. But I was like, yo, here's my comic. Go get it signed. Dude signs it. He's like, good luck, Jay, because uh, Carlos told him that I want to write comics. Mm. And then he's like, you know, we need more young bloods in the game, blah, 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 mm. because there's not a lot of them. And I was like, so I took that to heart. Yeah. So then I'm sitting at the February one. I'm just like, yo, he's right yeah, over yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and then day one, he wasn't there. I'm like, yo, what's going on? But I look up the schedule. He's like, oh, he's going to be there Saturday uh-huh. and Sunday. I was like, okay, so I got to wait. <laughs> so he shows up Saturday and I'm like, yo, I've never been this close. I've never seen him in person. And then I had my comics, I signed it. And then there was a long line to get stuff autographed. I was like, yeah, I can't oh, wait there because I got to sell my yeah, stuff. Yeah, It's like, so I got to go make money. Yeah, 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 I was like, I got to make money. Damn, and then my wife was like, yo, I'll wait in line. I'm like, you sure? Yeah. Like, you trying to wait in line? Oh, so she, yeah, so she. So she waited in line. Oh, I wow. was like, yo, you're the goat for that. Yeah. And then. She women's history month. Got there. No, women's, yeah. <laughs> women's history. Women's history. Her street. Her street. Her street. There we go. Yeah, I just brought some some women in. Today. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, she she was there, and then uh, my best friend's uh, wife was there as well because she did, she wanted to keep her company, and then she texted me. I was like, hey, I'm not signing anything because there was like another 
there was a woman there who was taking payments because you have to pay to get stuff signed. So yeah. that's yeah. the thing. Yeah, yeah. And I, 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 yeah. First time I went to Comic Con, I didn't yeah. understand, and I was just like, everything was just like money, 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 <laughs> money. Yo, I think you there, you're like, oh, pay money. Yeah. I'll, I'll oh, tell wow. you a Stanley story, yeah. which is dep- depressed me. But anyway, uh. um, I get to the front and I meet him, and I'm like, hey, I have nothing to sign, but I want to give you my first published work, like. One one of uh, your words is one of the reasons why I kept going. Yeah, and he was like super touched. I got it on video and everything. And yeah, that's dope, man. I handed in my book. I was like, "Yo, I signed it." I was like, "Here, this is yours." Um, and then I sent, gave him my other comic. He was like super appreciative, and I, I felt really good about that. And then he was like, "You know, I have a class online." I was like, "Yeah, man, I know yeah. you got like, a class." <laughs> and Follow he's you, like, bro. Yeah, yeah I, I was Come like, yeah. still, yeah. Like, yeah. still trying to yeah. sell yeah. Yeah. God damn. Like, yeah, like, God. The <laughs> but that's what I thought too. Yeah. And then he goes, "Yo, I'll pay for the whole year." And then I'll, oh, it was like, shit. yeah. And he was just like, "You can come. We can talk about your comic, talk about stuff." And I was just like. Dude, yeah, you couldn't believe it. You probably couldn't believe it. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, no way. Yeah. I'm there like, uh, nah, I didn't real? expect this. Yeah. Yeah. So it was really dope. Did he take him up on the offer? So no, I emailed him. He gave me his email. I was yeah, like, they, yeah. so I can just reach yeah, out any time. So, so like, wait, you haven't done it yet? No, I did. Oh. So he's just. Wait, when su- was this? This was, this was in February, mm-hmm. but dude is super busy, dude. Mm-hmm. So like, I waited and I sent him a second email. I was like, yo. Why is he not responding? <laughs> but like I'm following him on Instagram and Twitter, mm. and he's just like he's just he's doing all stuff. Yeah. So yeah. I'm like he's yeah. probably not seeing it. So then I I went on the class thing to see how much what the year was. I was mm-hmm. like it was like seventy five bucks. I was like I'm gonna just do oh, that. Yeah, yeah. Right. and I just did it. And I was yeah. like the next time he does a class, he did a class last week, but I wasn't there because I had like work or I had I went to a, oh, the applause museum. Re- Retracted. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 But, I, but the, <laughs> the thing is that I got his information and I'm just like I'm happy I got that. Yeah, so it was like awesome, really yeah for him to even give you like, yeah. email. Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. People would like if crazy fanatics would probably email I was like, yo, I got a Batman uh, yeah. special. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like I don't want to write Batman. Oh. I want to write my own yeah. stuff. Oh, and then real quick the Stanley story. Oh, Stanley. So the depressing part of this, this was 2020 2013. Bro, I went to Comic Con and I had my comic ready. I had my Funko Pop. No, I didn't even have a Funko Pop. I had a, I had a comic ready. I wanted to sign because he wrote it. He wrote a comic book that I bought with other writers like Chris Claremont and all those other people. And I was I was on the line, and then I find out you have to pay. Mm. At that time, it was seventy five dollars. What? Yeah. Wait, to to get this shit signed. <laughs> so yeah, anything, anything, anything to get signed. Money. Anything. Everything's money. Seventy five. Because think about it. Other Stanley doesn't really make money unless he's signing or doing other stuff. He doesn't mm-hmm. make money from like ro- like maybe some royalties. Cause, like, nah, but from the, the movies though, don't they got to go through him? I mean, he's no. dead already. So. No, you know no, what I'm saying. But, but no, at that those, time, they invite him because he doesn't own the rights to any of them. Oh. Remember, everything he created belongs to Marvel. They, oh, they're the entity. Shit. So even yeah. though he created Spider Man, it doesn't it belong to him. to him. Yeah. Yeah, he gets credited, but he doesn't belong oh, to him. Shit. So it's a, it's a whole business yeah. stuff. So I'm Damn. not gonna get into all business that. Business shit. It's called rape. But you saw side story from what I saw in Comic Con is like let's say if you get so a buddy of mine mm. is big into it, right? So he has uh some of the Funko Pops from like mm. the voice act and he had the voice actors mm. uh sign it, mm. but then now to get it like authenticated you have to go oh, what? CGC is right yeah. there. Yes. So CGC is a Dude, certification. A, go- yep. So like when I went so First time I went to see Stanley, I I couldn't. I went to the ATM, mind mm-hmm. you. Everyone's at this ATM, oh, so, oh, so I'm waiting on. I finally get the money. Point and in line for everything. Yeah, yeah. Bro, Stanley's gone. I was like, oh, no, shit. I was depressed. So bro. wait, wait. The, the the first time you went to go see him, you didn't know it cost Brett. Mm-hmm. I didn't know it cost and, Brett. And, and then mind. you didn't see him. I never saw him at, 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 until the next Comic Con. Oh, and, and, and then you're like, Brett. You had the bread, right? And then I know he's at the five hundred dollars. I came with a thousand dollars cash in my pocket. I was ready, and then one of my boys was like I was like doors open a uh, uh, comic con I was like I'm going straight yeah. to Stan Lee went into that line line was on my boy's like yeah, I'm gonna stay with you and we were just there we're talking we get there bro I couldn't say where's to Stan because he's one of my heroes I'm yeah. just looking at him and I'm like we're having this mental conversation I'm you like, can yeah like you raised me bro. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so he signs he signs my comic he signs my Funko Pop and then CGC is right there yeah and they're like oh what do you want to get because they have to witness it so yes. you go through the line yes yeah because if because anyone can just be like oh, oh yeah, yeah. he signed it. yeah and, and even that uh, you have to pay for and that's who i did it to to what was so that authenticated for? to so authenticated. make it certified get yeah. the fuck out of so here. now so, if you want to sell it later on oh, and, and, and got it, you, it's, got it's you, got authentic you. it's like this is so legit. you pay him too 
I pay him to sign it, and then and you, you pay, have to pay the CGC. Oh, yeah. This shit is but crazy. Yeah. You want to know? It's funny. When he's when I went to him again to sign it, it was a hundred dollars. So it went up twenty five dollars. Oh he wasn't playing. But okay, yeah, yeah. I, like I said, I had a thousand dollars in my pocket. No, he was ready. So he was ready. How, how about if you film while he's signing? That's right there. It's well, a, it's well a whole, now because then at the same time I could get a fake one and have you know replica, and now I could have sell. I could sell ten of those and be like, no, I have the video right here. So it's right. Yeah. So but yo, but it's nuts because even then they have a place. The central place is in Orlando or is in. Florida because I know a buddy of mine they, they take let's say you have a card signed by Barry Bonds yeah. and you want to get authentic you send it to Orlando mm -hmm. they yeah. make sure they authentic and then they send it back but my biggest fear nah, is always what about if them motherfuckers yeah, 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 exactly. I don't know I don't know I'm like, 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 going like, to yeah, Orlando yeah, yeah. So people do <laughs> with that. my car yeah people do that a lot of times oh yeah but like, why, why, why there why, why there though why, why, I why that's the headquarters that's the big style it's crazy wherever rent is cheap that's the yeah I went to Comic Con for the first time was it two years ago and I experienced all that I was just like I was in shock I was like oh wow the cool and Bruce Leroy was there. Like, Get the fuck out of here. Bruce Leroy was Every, there. Everyone who's That's everyone. Man, it, dude, it's, it's like time to collect that day. Like, if I you were anyone, that. you were in any movie, you did any That's comic time or whatever. To get some money. Oh, bro, you name it, they were there. You're yeah. like, dude, Damn, I took Bruce a picture Leroy. of uh, Papa Shango. Uh, what? Yeah. Papa, Papa Shango? Shango? Yeah, Papa Shango. And then, uh, fuck. who else? The, the whole train. Oh, that's uh, the pimp. Yes, um, yes. Dude, yeah. everyone like legit, like yeah. and, and, like Pokemon stuff, and then the whole train. And yeah, then it like, literally what? changes. It's like yeah. Pokemon, and then it's basketball. It, like, yeah. There's yes. sports in there. Yes. Like it's just what? crazy. Everything. It's, it's an event. It's pretty it's dope. Comic Con used to just be comic books, and yeah. then it yeah. just became movies. Pop culture. Everything. Everything. Yeah, well, wow, that's crazy. I stopped going dope. to that shit once you had a like, kid. Stand on virtual line to then get on the yeah. line uh, to get the ticket yeah. and the meal, yeah. and I was like, nah, I'm yeah. good. No, and that was like my goal was to meet Stanley. Once I did, I just stopped going. Were, yeah, and then okay. I went the last time uh, this past October, and I was like, I, I was there for four hours. I was like, I don't want to be here. I want to. Uh, I want to yeah, be the one. People. I want to be the one selling. I, I hear you. You want to have your own booth I, there. Yeah. I want to have my own booth there. So Dude, I'm that's like, awesome, I, man. Like it's just weird. I, I get yeah. New York Comic Con's weird with that. Cause it's like I was like I want to know how to apply. It's not as easy, so it's just weird. Oof. So I was like, why? There's some weird gatekeeping that's going yeah. on. Oh, every that's yeah. Yeah. Once, once you get a ticket, you could go all four days. When you buy the four day pass, yeah. trying, get the fuck out of so, yeah, no so one ticket is not the four day. No, no, no. Sorry. It's one day. Because Man, some people can't go. Of money there. Yeah, some yeah. people can't go all day. So some people buy like a Friday. They buy. A oh, got you, got and you. Then the, yeah. yeah. But you're not gonna see it all in one day. Oh, you do. You, you can, could, you can. but there's just so much. Oh, like wow. you could, different you days could, have different panels. And there's that too. So I don't really do panels, yeah. but you can literally. I've walked all the whole thing. Oh, but there's God, stuff yeah. you miss. Dude. Got you, got so, you, got you. Yeah. Like I said, John Leguizamo. I met John Leguizamo oh, there. Like, dude, they, yeah, it's like everyone, dude. Like whoever, I'm telling you, I'm. I'm gonna think of more people. Like yeah, whatever, yeah. Just, they're there. <laughs> yeah. They're there, but it, it is a hard. Find Giuliani there, like. Yeah, <laughs> 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 uh, uh, I saw Bruce Lee over with a little straw struck. Oh, yeah. oh Bruce Lee, right? <laughs> yeah, That's yeah, that guy right there. <laughs> they be walking around too. Yeah. Like some That's people don't recognize them, so right. people so, like like they're not like I don't want to say they're not a listers, but if they're not a listers and they're walking around, yeah, you would. If you like were to be able to pinpoint, you can walk up to them. Like, Yo, look That's what's up. up. Yeah, yeah, especially when they're walking around. Uh, uh, the Warriors. A couple of guys from the Warriors are there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. out in play. Yeah, that's pretty dope. Yeah. I'm I, it, it, but it is tough. My uh, a tough realization when you go there, and you don't know that everything, literally everything, costs money. Yes, dude, you gotta pay. I, because I was of the mindset of, oh, I pay a ticket, I'm good. No, yeah, no, right. you go in there, you're like, ah, ah, well, ah. and then even now because of the square spacing technology and everything, yeah. it's just like boop boop. Oh well, yeah, no, you don't have to worry about the cash. It's just like yo, yeah. right here. It's crazy oh, to right. think about, like even how far back I. I mean, not far back, but like, yeah, well, actually, well, even it was like 2013. Yeah, so in 2013, that was not even there. Yeah, it's all cash. cash. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah, it's all cash. Like there were things that were free, like here and there. It was like it was swag bullshit. It was like swag bullshit. Yeah, like, yeah. it was just stuff like that, and then. There were times, I'm like, I took some stuff. But like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, because I remember I was like, oh, this is a cool poster. And then me and my friend was like, yo, take it. I'm like, no, you take it. And he walked away and I was like, and I walked the other direction. We yo. met up and I was oh, like, motherfuckers did a whole grand <laughs> high school. Yo, right? yo this, this was, you know, what was it? The Fast and the Furious before it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But, the heist. Um, the heist. The, you know. Y'all go dressed up? I, I, I've never done that. 
I've never dressed up, but I if I do something, it's simple. So like one time, I just wore like a button down with like the Superman shirt. Oh god, gotcha. I don't go crazy. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Poser. Because, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, oh, just look at this chump. Yeah. Yeah. He yeah. did it coming yeah. all the way. Yeah, yeah. are no those didn't. glasses real too? Yeah. Like, you're no, a you imagine I'd be like, you're right, you caught me. <laughs> <laughs> you're a phony. Nah, my, it's funny, my, my boy Marvin did the same thing. He'll go with his suit and the same thing, Superman mm-hmm. shirt underneath. Because some people be wild. Yo, well, shout out I don't want to say I don't want to say nah. Wallen though yeah, because some, some of some mm-hmm. of them are like like so when I was in MegaCon they were like very like they spent time and yeah. like, yeah, really like, good. Like insane. Like, um, are you guys aware of uh, Attack on Titan? Yeah. Oh yeah. 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 No. So like no. so it's an anime, <laughs> but Dope. like like so you know like the the the, the cross thing the the uh, no or like the, the wings. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's like the the white and blue wings. Mm-hmm. So someone came in dressed with like the knives. I've seen and a whatever, lot of those. Yeah. But she actually made wings, like legit, the black, the legit. blue and white wings. That's and I was like, it. that's like and innovative. It takes time, yeah. Like yeah, if you can creative. change it up and be creative, I was like, yo, I dig that. Yeah. Nah, it's dope. it's like legit, 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 legit costume design shit. Like people do, they fabricate stuff. I remember watching on Sci-Fi. They, I think it was mm. Sci-Fi. They had a whole comic con type of. Um, show where people were showing their process oh, called, of how they were building this yeah, shit yeah, yeah, that's crazy and i was like nah that, that, and i can imagine now with 3d printing and everything oh like, man that yeah was people must be going yeah, crazy that. doing that shit it was, it was yeah really cool but but like the, the stuff that you buy and the stuff that you pick up too like um authentic things that are hard to find all throughout like i just learned about whatnot and my mm. buddies on there all the time but when <laughs> my buddy marvin you know he came the, the backpack wasn't big enough. He needed a, a suitcase, mm. like to roll. Like yo, yeah. he went and he, yo, he was like, I gotta do this, I gotta do that. He bought everything. But that, that's, that's like a, I was just like, holy smokes! Yeah, that's a lifestyle. Like two grand. Though. I, can't I, I felt like it was like two grand. Yeah, it's a lifestyle. Like you gotta be. It's like collecting sneakers. It's the yeah. same thing. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Yes. Just like that. Like yeah. half acid. Like, no. For me, I, I got my Stan Lee thing. I got the comic book signed, graded. Mm-hmm. It's considered a uh, signature, uh, signature, uh, signature graded. So mm-hmm. it loses points because. You wrote on the book, That's but crazy, yeah. it's because of Stan Lee, yeah. he gets a different grade. Yeah. Now he signed my Funko Pop, but I didn't get that uh, graded. It's but crazy. like with a couple months, I did buy it with the sticker, so I have two Funko Pops signed by Stan Lee. Oh, so yeah, one of them is wrong. mine because yeah. I know I signed yeah. it. One of them I can just sell it. Yeah. What is some Funko That's- Pop? The, the the toys oh. with the big heads. I was just about oh, to got you. Okay, okay, okay. The bubble. Yeah, yeah, yeah that was that. Yeah. Mm, yeah. bobbleheads yeah so it was a stan lee uh, bobble oh yeah. Shit. yeah yeah it was the the first one. Oh yeah. wow because they're like a whole bunch of those but yeah that's wild good. yeah so once i met stan lee i was good that was fine. <laughs> like, i'm done i'm done with this shit <laughs> <laughs> now but but it's it's amazing how you went from wanting to be you know just like on on the interested consumption side of mm-hmm. of, of uh of taking in all the content and, and all the stuff but then you know that realization of that moment like Fuck this shit, man. I need to be the one yeah, selling yeah, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right fuck now. that. We fucking be a yeah. fan all the no, time, no, no, man. No, 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 I mean, yeah. business. Yeah. I mean, for fucking business. No, I understand that because as, as a creator, right? Like, you, I mean, you have all these dope things. You're like, and I can imagine not to be arrogant, but I'm sure you probably see some things and you're like, nah, come on. That could, yeah. That, that no, could yeah. Be so me. in 2013 or even in high school, I remember like going through my Comic Con. I went to Comic Con first time, I think it was like junior year or sophomore year in high school. I remember seeing some stuff. So, like, when it came to, like, DC and Marvel, obviously they're going to do well because they're the big heads. But when you go into, like, Artist Alley and then you see, like, the indie stuff, there was a lot of, like, old heads there because they probably just just do their stuff. And you look at their comic and their art, it's not appealing Mm -hmm. because I went and I was just like, and I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Sometimes it's trash Mm because then looking at the cover, you see, like, black characters, which we don't see a lot of black characters on on, on the front cover. But they have black hair, they have baggy jeans. But I'm like, and, then, and they have like gold chains. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they went, but it, it didn't appeal to me because I was like, what is this? I'm yeah, like, I think, it is it like very, are like they trying to cater to someone like me? Yeah. I'm like, I didn't find that because imp- I want to see like black people doing space stuff or yeah, yeah, something, yeah. Bro. like something different, yeah. right? Like in Lord of the Rings, like when you watch the movies. Mm-hmm. I don't think you ever see a black person. Oh, no, and that's what I'm thinking. Oh, like, you, I have to recall. I have to think of it. And I I've seen, so. I've seen I, that movie, the, like the extended cut. Like, yeah. I'm like, I don't and remember. Still, but it's weird. In a world of fantasy, you would think a black person no. or any brown person <laughs> lives Something. there. Right? <laughs> well, even Star Wars. In a Middle world Wars. where there's aliens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, yeah. In a world where there's aliens, not one what? black <laughs> Besides <laughs> Samuel Jackson and Lando. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But that was late yeah. on. Yeah. They threw, oh, like, all right, we need to throw some yeah. colors. Let's, let's throw Lando Calrissian. Yeah. We need to expand the market. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
But old yeah, school, like, nobody's I, black. No. Yeah, so, so. Yeah, all Spanish, <laughs> no nothing. That's just crazy. I, I just don't understand how we we always end up and everywhere. And the only thing that the 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 same consistency and the only continuity we can always create it have is baggy jeans and gold jeans. That's fucking crazy. <laughs> no, yeah, and that's yeah. fucking so, crazy. So, mind you, I'm a high school kid and it just turned me off because I was like, okay, whatever. Yeah. Like, what are they trying... I stopped by and looked at the booth and they were like trying to get me to... I was like... Mm-hmm. Nah, my man. I was like, I didn't... I wasn't interested in that at the time. But now, because indie comics are getting more attention and it's like, I'm trying to catch that wave so like, that, it you know, the, anyone in the higher-ups can see that. Like, it, it's... I think something's gonna happen when it comes to that. Like a lot of people are just gonna like recognize people of color gotcha, like doing that stuff. Like when I did, so like my car- when you say a lot of people, mm. are you referring to just white people? Because no, anyone, because like, what, just, so what outside of the industry? Mm. Why do you feel we're not acknowledging ourselves? To answer that question, that could be a whole conversation. But like <laughs> no, so like people, people like us won't. Are, I don't want to say won't, are kind of conditioned. Mm. For example, we grew up with the Spider-Mans, the X- X-Men. Yeah, oh, the white wash. The X-Men but 97. X-Men, X-Men, but X-Men is supposed to be representation of people of color. Yeah, it's supposed to be about racism. I'm just going yeah. to gonna move that to the side. But you mm. got the Spider-Mans, you got the uh, Superman's, Batman. And then whenever you tell a story, for some reason, even myself, I, I'm guilty of this as a kid, you tell a story and there's always a white person. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Um, I mean, you're right. Oh. One, uh, this guy uh, who has call, is called the antagonist. He has his own comic. He's he's successful. Um, he showed his stuff. He's like, yo, when I used to draw, it was always a white person. It was mm. weird. We were conditioned this way. Yeah, that's true. Though. When you yeah. watch, when you would watch, unfortunately, when you watch these movies, the black guy or the Spanish guy is always <laughs> mm-hmm. getting killed. Mm-hmm. So it's just like it's because they want they don't want to get they don't want to pay them anymore. <laughs> no, they got to cut them off the roll fast. Shout, <laughs> shout out to LL L- Cool J for surviving. <laughs> yeah, but, for real. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but it, oh, so it, so to answer your question, I think everyone, and this includes anyone of color um, or white. That's not a color, or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> everyone, everyone in the planet needs to see what people that are not big business could do. Mm. Because, like for example, a comic book in like regular comics, you go to comics, it's like what three to five dollars a pop. Big companies can afford that. Mm. Indie comics uh, creators can create their books mm. and sell it for like eight to ten dollars. Mm. Not a lot of people know cost, so I sell my books for eight bucks. If I do like a variant cover with like holographic uh, covers, I sell them for twelve bucks. No one people think it's like cheap, and I was like, yeah. but it's like I and I add like stuff to it, like the soundtrack and stuff, because I kind of want to give people more, so they don't feel that's, like they're getting cheated. Mm. But the thing is, we always got to justify the value. Yeah, but like the thing is, I didn't have to do that, and right. they would still pay the eight. Correct. But now you're adding more value, mm-hmm. one above and beyond. So. Now, I want so and to answer your second question as well, people like us should see that the value in seeing themselves in our stuff. Yeah, because it's like white people can look at our stuff and be like, "All right, cool." Because that's another thing. I went to Florida, and you know, there's not a like. I loved it there, but the clientele I was looking for was people of color to stop by. Because I've had some guys like, "Yo, I love seeing uh, you know a black dude doing his thing, selling books where there's a black person in the cover." And I was like, yeah, man, like my, my Napoleon has a, I say white now, but that, that kind of extends to, I don't want to spoil the story, but, (laughs) but most of, most of the characters in my covers are black and then they're shaded in a way that they're not like stereotyped because it's supposed to represent everyone. And that was like the whole thing with my story, like in my alien heroes, which is the cartoon that I wanted to make that. I realized, well, like, that I can turn into a comic because animation costs money. Oh, man. Like, it costs, like, for, like, 30 seconds. Yeah. Like, someone was, like, trying to charge me $300, like, a second. And what? I was, like... Damn, that, damn, that takes dude, a lot of work in the animation shit. But animation is, is expensive yeah. and is a lot of work. Yeah. But and but, but with AI, is, maybe it's going to be different now. Well, we'll see. <laughs> uh, but it, it, was, it was one of those things where I was, like, oh, I'll turn my cartoon because i had the the storyboards and i was like this looks like a comic so right. i was like turned into a comic book and not to like um stunt but i was able to talk to heads of nickelodeon and are you still <laughs> stunning that's what's up yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not to stunt yeah, 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 yeah. So, like, the nigga's not doing too hot right now 
<laughs> so they, okay. they, they, they need all the help they can get. <laughs> they better no, start looking okay. elsewhere. So, uh, <laughs> uh, what is, what is, yeah. so that's so deep. <laughs> that's so deep. Uh, yeah. So yes. Uh, <laughs> Damn that that messed up my childhood. Oh, yeah. oh damn! But I didn't. Cool. I, you know, I, I grew up with like Cartoon Network and Disney, but not so much Nickelodeon. Nickelodeon, but more I watched more of the cartoons. Nickelodeon, I watched okay. Drake and Josh a lot because that was like my thing. But mm-hmm. anything else, it was just SpongeBob, Danny Phantom. What's another popular one? Uh, Fairy Godparent. Oh no, that's not oh, Cartoon Avatar. Network, isn't it? No, 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 no that was. was oh, yeah, yeah. 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 shit is Ren and Stimpy. I, 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 I'm literally Ren about to Stimpy. Stimpy. Yeah, 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 yeah
Um, and I'm trying to build a fan base as well when I go to these conventions because mm-hmm. if I can have this following, people are going to want more. Of course, yeah. So it's going to take time, but it's just like right now I have issue zero and then issue one, and mm. then I have four more books. So I'm just like it trying to build time. that. And you're yeah. super young. You're Hell yeah. yeah. One, I'm two. Good. One, I just good. feel like, yo, like. Super because, young, man. You just, yo, that's, that's amazing yeah. what you've accomplished. Hell yeah. Because four, yeah. you said basically four years ago, what, you were 27 then? Mm-hmm. Or, yeah, 20. Yeah, well, yeah. Yeah. And, or, yeah. or 26 or 27? Yeah, about. Man, in math. Yeah. Well, I mean, because <laughs> if he's going to be 32, that's yeah. what, but whatever. Yeah. You get my point. <laughs> okay. No, I got it. This is why they should have taught us better in school. Yeah, right. Publishing your own comic, you know, Nickelodeon, nah. um, in four yeah. years, right? That's what we talk about. That's yeah, crazy. That's wild, man. Good Fuck. For you. Nah, I, you know what's the thing? I have to. I keep telling myself. My wife tells me, and then like therapists tell me, like, "Yo, you gotta be like acknowledging what you're doing." Because sometimes I just feel like I'm not where I'm at, at mm, right yeah. now. So I'm just like, "Yo, I want to do more. I want to be like." My goal is to just work part time at my job. I work full time there, and if I can go part time there, that means something's changing. Yeah, definitely. Because I can just supplement all that like money into my projects. Oh man, I, I just keep rem- trying to remember how you said it exactly. It was like money and time to daydream. Yeah, I, 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 I love that. Daydream yeah. is, is the yeah. goal. I, I love, love that. that. That's I the, love that. Yeah. Yeah. Cause yeah, I can just spend my time writing. Yeah, like that's the thing. I haven't written in a long time. I'll rework, edit my scripts, but I haven't written anything new. Ideas come out, but I don't sit down and do them because gotcha. I'm like, then I move away from the stuff that I've already created. So I just want to get those out there. Yeah. Uh, Cause why wait until you fall asleep to dream if you could daydream? Yeah, this God. <laughs> <laughs> I just started yeah, off there right now. In the background, just like you're plotting. Hey, hey, yeah, yeah. And the daydream, yeah, yeah. you could actually remember. That was dope. Oh, yeah, very true. And you yeah, yeah. Uh, that, that was my last words. I got to come up with nothing better than that. Early. Yeah, that's right, yo. He, he needs to disappear and come back with yeah. another one. <laughs> <laughs> so just skip me for last words. I'm, just, I'm noticing Dude, that. That was I'm it. That, that, that was the intro to last words. There you go. Daydreams, you could you could at least remember and make ideas with it and just keep going. There you go. Uh, I, I, Fuck that, yeah. Bars. <laughs> bars. There you go, bars. bars. Quick question. Marvel or DC? Both. No, you got to pick one. <laughs> said that, said, right? said if I, okay. If, if you I had, had to pick choose, one. Yeah. it was DC. DC. Because, cool. um, and if we're, uh, but like, how are we categorizing? Is this movies? This is books? Like The whole shebang. The whole shebang? I, I, would, I would focus more on the comics because... Yeah. It still leads into like the movies and stuff like that. Yeah, because um, DC got some whack. It, movies, the thing right? is, they've been trash. They've, trash, they've, they've yeah. been. But it's Warner Brothers. Oh. Thank you. Yeah, it's oh. not DC. It's Warner. As Warner Brothers fucking it up. Yeah, got you. But because we know the story that James Gunn is going to do, though, fix it. But he's going to do his own. No, not fix it. But he's doing his own thing. Yeah. So, Did but you? anyway, <laughs> but my, comics. They comics. When it comes to the comics, <laughs> like when it comes to the comics, if I were to choose, because it'd be DC, because. Their writers are consistent. Like when with the New Fifty Two, we spent the whole New Fifty Two with Scott Snyder writing, uh-huh. so the story doesn't feel different. You know, it's, I still feel the writers' like style in that story. Well, I remember reading a dope. Uh, well, the first part of it was dope. It was a Spider Man comic called Avenging Spider Man. It was just like a new run. It was the key thing was Spider Man teaming up with random members of the Avengers. The the art was by this dude named Joe Moderera. So his style was very like manga type. Mm. So I was like, I love the art. I love that artist and the, the the writer. And then he writes for like five issues and then leaves. Both writer and artist leave. Continue story with someone else and the art was whack. Uh, uh, and I was like, why do they keep doing this? They do this with a lot of like uh, stories in there and Marvel. And then lately, because of how popular the MCU is, Marvel Comics became the advertisement for their movie, so it was working backwards. Mm-hmm. Now. So I hated that. So I was like, I barely collected comics from Marvel. Then DC is doing it now, but DC wasn't doing it for a long time, so I stayed with DC. And then DC movies were doing their thing. Like I, I love some some of their movies, and then they started doing that with their comics. I was like, oh, and I just stopped collecting. Got so you. there are certain things I collect. DC has an imprint called DC Black Label, so it's like it's not part of the main story. Yeah, okay. It's just like its own thing. So I will collect those stuff, but I generally stopped collecting in 2015 because that's when New 52 stopped. So I was like, yeah. Black Label's cool. No no pun intended, but it's like all the darker shit. Okay. Like it's dark. <laughs> yeah. Black, dark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. <laughs> um, it's, it's, it's very... It's more. It's, Mar- Mar- it's more adult. It's more Mar- dark night. Marvel, yeah. Shit. yeah, Marvel had their own, but they literally or well not literally in the world literally blew it up it was called um the ultimate universe mm. that that's where most of the mcu got their inspiration from so it was uh 
it's weird. So 616 is the main continuity, and then Ultimate Universe is like 16 something. I forget the numbers, but like they blew it up, and they were like, we're done writing those. And then that's how they got Miles Morales to be in the main continuity. Uh, and it was, it was just like weird. I was like, why'd they do that? They could have kept that. Writers stay consistent. Mm, yeah. I would have been reading that, but it was whatever. Um, but yes, the DC. Uh, DC. Yeah. <laughs> I would say one thing. I, like, it's not big into the comics, but the DC, um, the Justice League, like, I feel like all of those are dope. Just uh, there's the, one on the HBO movie? Max. No, no, the oh, cartoons. The cartoon. Oh, that was that was good. Oh hell yeah, that, that was, was fire. That, 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 that was good. Batman, yeah, Superman. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Batman Batman Beyond. Very good. Talking about just, the old school joint. The old school yeah, joint. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, but even now, there's something on HBO about, Max that they're the New Frontier or the cartoon. Oh, there's a bunch. The DC. So, yeah, yeah. They're they're cartoon gamers. Yeah. So they're yeah. So that's the thing. DC or WB's animation group. Yeah. Um, did superb when it came to their animation animated movies. So they had their own universe, which kind of took from New 52, and then they had, like, movies that were adapting comic books, like The Dark Knight Returns, which is fire. Because yep. their, their soundtrack, great. Sounds like eight is very 80s, it makes you feel like you're there, which is when ba- The Dark Knight, I see you have Dark Knight 3 yeah, there. Yeah. <laughs> Dark Knight Returns is in the 80s as well. But, yeah, their animated stuff is great. Uh, but the classic stuff, yeah. Again, Batman Beyond, Static oh, Shock, man. Zeta Project. If you remember yeah. that, like it's just the yeah. Zeta Project. Taking it now with Batman Beyond, right? That's coming back or something. And then the because I read something that the, they have the original voice actor. The story from was that the, Terry. I mean the, the character. Yeah, yeah. I, I got you. Yeah. yeah, I forget his name too. Yeah. Um, <laughs> no, the the guys that did uh, Cross the Spider Verse, or sorry, Into the Spider Verse slash uh, Beyond the Spider Verse, they showed concept art to WB and like, hey. We can do Batman Beyond, and mm. they said no. Oh. And the internet was like, "You guys are bugging," because mm-hmm. <laughs> Sony, who owns Spider Man, did s- freaking great mm. with that. And WB is like, "No, we don't want to do Batman Beyond." I'm like, "You would Why? make money. <laughs> oh, That's yeah. such we, a missed opportunity." We only want to make things that suck. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we do here. And but well, you know what it is? I kind of get why, but then at the same time, it doesn't touch because James Gunn and um, Peter Safran are doing resetting DC. They're going to try to be more... They're trying to be the Kevin Feige of their thing. They set up the whole thing. I get that. Mm. But in the meantime, give us something to enjoy. Yeah. Make money mm. and stop canceling stuff. <laughs> because they cancel. They're becoming like um, Netflix. They just cancel anything. <laughs> like, I'll be watching something. I'm like, give it you, Give you two seasons. I'm like, all right. What happens next? Yeah. I'm not, you did that, done. That, that's a, a big reason of why I haven't gotten like committed to a lot of shit. Because I'm like, why am I going to fucking see this if have they're you, not going to mm-hmm. see it through? Exactly. Have you seen this show called Warrior? No. Yeah, so it used to be on Cinemax, which is DC's like subsidiary. Mm-hmm. But then it got absorbed by HBO on their season three. And it got canceled. Warrior. Warrior. Uh, it's based off the story. Yeah, I should have explained what Warrior oh, is. Okay, yeah. uh, Warrior is a story based off Bruce Lee's writing. What? Yeah. I have not heard of it. It is fire. Yeah. You, you just sold me on just sharing that part. Yeah. 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 But Bruce unfortunately, Lee, so. the, for, it's fortunately and for, unfortunately. So unfortunately, it got canceled. But Netflix picked it up. If it gets watched a lot, just like uh, Young Justice, if you remember Young That's Justice. That's Rose. Don't uh, Young, Young Justice. Justice got picked up uh, back on HBO and yeah. they made more seasons. Yeah. If uh, Warrior does well with their streaming, they'll probably make another season. Gotcha. Because the way season three ended, I was like, there's no way they're going to end with that. And it's just canceled. Ended with for what? Wow. <laughs> it just canceled. It, it, it ended with that. And that's what's going on with Young Justice now, where it's like, they, well, yeah. I think it's in limbo, right? Right it's, now it's in limbo. But after the, the rewatches, because I, I play, I had it on repeat every yeah. time, because I love that show. I, I, I they made two more seasons. Sick. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So. Huh. Mm. Very good. Very good. I was like, and I, and I like all the episodes, like the writing, everything, yeah. like the if continuity a, of show, it. Yeah, check it out. If there's a show that just got canceled and it has love, keep watching it. It builds, like, it shows yeah. that people okay. like it. Yeah. I'm Done. not buying into that, but okay. <laughs> Call all your friends. <laughs> Go to work and that shit just repeat. It's a, it's a shot in the dark. It's like those motherfuckers that be like, Call well, your it's... local representative <laughs> <laughs> and let them know that you don't Dude, want them to ban yeah, abortion or whatever. It's, it's, yeah. <laughs> and it's just stuff happens. It's like, no, fuck out of here, man. Everybody yeah. lying, but all right, cool, whatever. I mean, things that, that had great progress like that. Uh, family Guy, obviously, right? Got canceled mm. and then came yeah. out. Yeah. Family Guy and Futurama. Yeah, Arrested Development, which are but that's uh, just motherfuckers not Same wanting thing. to pay for new new stuff, and they need slots to fill in. So. Oh, but but, but that but that yes. goes back mm-hmm. to what you're saying too. Like my and I talk, me and my boy talk about it in our podcast a lot. Like the thing where I, I don't like Hollywood because Hollywood is too like about money. It and we've known this for a long time. It's always you know those great movies are the ones that are low budget. Mm. 
Now those movies that spend billions of dollars on making movies do trash. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, not Zack Snyder's movie, but Justice League. Mm-hmm. WB threw mad money on it. Try to digitally yes. remove this dude's mustache. <laughs> that and hard. They spent and they didn't make their money back. No. You could have no. spent fifty million from and the bat it. and made mad money yeah. and do a good story and make mad money. When when uh, Zack Snyder released, he d- he took no money from it. He probably took money, yeah. but he took no money from it. And, Snyder cut and the, the Snyder cut. And I was like, this is the movie that should have been that's the theaters. So, yeah. Like, well, obviously not I still haven't watched it because I'm like, yeah, it's but, it's, like, it's, one those, it. it's one of those things where if you've seen the the Justice League, mm-hmm. right, let's call it. <laughs> if you've seen that version, you should see this. Got it. And it's unfortunately like the way it ends is like, damn, they set it up. Well, he set it up because they, and mind you, they get, it's like if someone told you do this and you put so much pressure on him because of how good MCU is doing. Yeah. Look, I yeah. Would, and I will, I will defend Zack Snyder for what he was trying to do. I won't defend WB for what they did. But some of the movies were trash. Like, I love Man of Steel. Uh, I love Wonder Woman 1, not 2. 2 was trash. Was you like Batman, or whatever, Batman with Superman? What happened? You like Batman with Superman? I, I liked it. I didn't, what I'll say is I liked it, but... I think it could have been better. So when you saw the cut, which is another thing, WB keeps shortening his movies and they keep cutting it and they're like, oh, we have the director's cut. cut. And it's yeah. like, why do you keep doing it? Let, <laughs> let the man do this. Yeah, thing. you're right. Let him cook. Right. Let him work. Exactly. Yeah. So that's why the movie doesn't do well. So And people will disagree with me with this, but uh, BVS is the same as uh, Civil War. The same movie. Hmm. Just one is told better. Really? Civil War yeah. was yeah. fucking dope, though. Yeah. Hmm. Think about it. You, hmm. have, you have one villain who just... He had two heroes fighting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Civil like, that's War just was... a basic plot point. But yeah, Civil War movie. was the shit. I love. Civil I like War. Civil War. Yeah. That was a good. You ain't like Civil War? No, no. Yeah, oh, I'm about to say that was a good. No, no. It was good. It was solid. It was my, my, yeah. I mean, well, I don't believe you. The way you say it, it was solid. Whatever. For some reason, I don't believe you, bro. No, because I was gonna go back to his point of. Uh, the disappointment that they've done uh, that WB has done with recutting certain films like yeah. I, I was gonna say yeah Civil War's dope but I, I was really excited he was, he was, he was disappearing yeah. 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 he was fading he was thinking, thinking. Yeah. Yeah. Like, he was thinking. thinking. <laughs> he was like <laughs> I was I, I was really yeah. excited for Suicide Squad and oh that shit was a disappointment the and, David Ayer one huh? David Ayer the first yeah. one and Agreed. I was super excited for that. Mm-hmm. And when that fucking trash ass villain came out, I was like, "Who the fuck the is first this one or guy? The second one? In the in the in the first the one. first Wait. one. No, the, the second the one second is one is, is, is called the, Suicide the Suicide Squad by James Gunn, yeah. which was okay. Yeah, but it wasn't. That's crazy. the one with the shark. That, 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 that. That, that's with uh, no, but that one that had the um, because that's with I, I, Idris. Yeah, 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 yeah. He was like replacing Will Smith. Yeah, 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 because exactly. you got to replace a black guy with yeah, another yeah, black yeah, guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's how they do. That's Come how they on, do. Come on, man. Can't have two black people. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like when they fucking yeah. replace Terrence Howard with Don Cheadle. Yeah, yeah. Oh, not the same. Yeah, yeah. Not the same. <laughs> like, it was like, ah, oh, amiguito black guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, let's put in the it's other guy. But no, no. So my the David Ayer one. Yeah, I did like the the first one. The the second one I did enjoy. It was cool. It was cool. But um. The first one, I was really disappointed yeah. with, because uh, I thought, yo, Will Smith and then everybody yeah, is going to be dope. People. And then, yeah, yeah. The, I, but I blamed it more on the cutting and I in the, the, the cutting. And mind you, after I think because Air movies, still swears by that shit. He oh, on on bro, Twitter. I would and, love to see that movie. Yeah, because okay, so speaking of the animated stuff, if you ever see, if you play the Arkham games, Asylum, yeah, or, oh yeah, the Batman. Batman. So yeah. there's a Robert there's an animated movie that ties into it. It's called Assault on Arkham. That should have been the movie. Oh, yeah, said, I've seen that. I saw an That should have been the movie. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because I was like, David Ayer was, I was like, David Ayer did Tank. Mm-hmm. He did, what are the, uh, Training Day. Like, I'm like, bro, he's a GOAT. And then when I see this movie, I was like, that wasn't David Ayer. That was WB. Oh, damn. WB, the, and I call him the Suits. Suits put their hand in this movie. It just, was it. They just messed it up. Damn. Like, oh. it, it should have it been a great movie. And, like, I saw what he was doing, but I was like, these don't make sense. And they were like, they shot a lot of, like uh, Joker stuff that could have been its own like hit that was cut down. Oh like, yeah, Jared like, Leto. Yeah, um, well uh, that was things, Leto, right? Yeah, yeah, Jared Leto. Leto. Yeah, yeah, like anything could. Be- and he also sweared by that character. He was like, "Yo, that shit was gonna but, be the truth," and yeah. blah blah blah. But even and, the movie didn't show that. And yeah. Again, if we see Assault on Arkham the, and the thing, I'm gonna just drop a knowledge here. The Joker, <laughs> the Joker. Any th- anytime Joker appears somewhere in a story, he's like the wild card. Like 
even villains when they see him and I, I like, quote this because my, my, me and my friends talk like, oh, we, we just talk about shit yeah like they're yeah, just yeah, like oh shit yeah. the joke is yeah. here yeah. don't care it like, doesn't matter the fuck party all the time yeah, 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 yeah. no matter how powerful you are when you see the Joker he's a problem, in, yeah. like, he's, a problem. He's, a problem. It, he's supposed to be like yo the Joker he's just like he's not part of the story he should have just messed things up mm-hmm. he shut shit down but, <laughs> The, the David Ayer movie, I was just like, why was he even in the movie? Why the you fuck he I mean? was wearing chains and tattoos? Is that a, a real Joker, like, in some other realm? No, I don't there's know. a mob version. There's, there's a, a mob there's version, a mob of, version of, of Joker. But not like that. Yeah, he was, was like, that, that was when he came out at the end, just to pick up Harley Quinn, right? Is that... Yeah, he got to pick up his bitch. Right? That, but that was it, right? That no, movie. then, he, then he's that, he got that scene with Common. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He yeah, was in a couple was, of scenes. But he wasn't... It didn't make sense for him to be there. He should have been there as, like, messing up a plan. Yeah. He, yeah, should have, uh, he was not supposed point. to be a villain. He or was the main strategic. Villain. He was... Yeah, he was just, like, showing up. And I was like, he was... He's supposed to mess things up. Gotcha. Yeah. He was just there for attendance. Yeah. <laughs> but it, it, was, spice it was it up, weird. I guess. That's why foreign movies are great. <laughs> <laughs> well, bad that we went on all these tangents. Yeah, yeah, we, just, yeah we just went. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I loved it, though. I'm like... Yeah, yeah. Shut over the last call for words. My brother, my main man, Trey Dresso. I know you say yeah, that. Nah, I, I just got to give a shout out to my brother yeah. right here, yeah. man. It's, yeah. a, it's a pure yeah. pleasure to see somebody go. I don't want to say, I never met somebody that worked on comics. Mm. You know, somebody that is just like us. And it's good and refreshing to see that other people are opening up avenues and seeing more creativity out there. And I'm not gonna drop no more bars today. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> so keep doing what you're doing, my brother. Keep doing what you're doing, my brother. I appreciate right. you. Thank you. He's Thank like, you. He's like, I'm gonna save it for the next cipher. <laughs> 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 my um, brother, uh, Jeremy Francois, yeah. aka J. Uh, thank you very much for coming mm. through, brother. Uh, what would be your last call for words? Um, well, first, I'm going to just plug in, like, buy my stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Word up. Fuck yeah. that. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. And the podcast. And, the podcast. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. and then, yeah, check out our podcast, The Average Jays. Um, we, you can put us in the background and just listen to us talk random stuff. But, um, no, yeah, like, uh, where, where can, well, you, you're talking oh. about, where can they pick up your stuff? Uh, yeah. If you follow me on Instagram, that's where I, like, post or, like, do my stuff. It's sky underscore surfer 117. That's where I, like, post all my stuff. So, Everything's there in the link tree. Uh, most of my books are on gumroad.com. So if you go through that, you can buy digital um, or physical. Um, I would have to like ship them to you. But yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, my first book, My Brother Teddy. I have variants as well. Uh, Alien Heroes, which I'm trying to get turned into a cartoon. So mm-hmm. buy that. Um, and Napoleon. Napoleon from the Machine, which is like, uh, that was like my creme de la creme. Like I just released issue two like this past week. Well, digitally, I need to make the physicals. But yeah, and... On top of that, besides being selfish, please don't give up on your dreams. Um, just don't stop and drink water. That's yeah. important. <laughs> don't forget the fucking water. water. Yeah, that's right. I like it. <laughs> that's right. Drink drink water. Water. That's a commercial. Right? Water. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. Yeah. Like, no one's paying. Place, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Mother Nature's like, here's your twenty bucks. <laughs> Yeah. My brother, my yeah. main man, always on point. The first thought of the day. <laughs> yeah. Ramirito. Hey, 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 hey. Turn that down. Turn that down. Get on here, man. Come on. Come on. Rams <laughs> McFly. Dude, you know what's funny? From the beginning of uh, of this episode when we started, you know, just the daydreaming aspect mm-hmm. of it. It's, it's just that. Just don't stop daydreaming. Like, that. Mm-hmm. that's really it. Yeah, I feel like that was uh, the sense of the episode. That's what kind of got us going so yeah. don't don't stop daydreaming yeah there you go it's hard work it is yeah. it is man it is but it's fun work yeah and especially when you have to like you said putting the work down and then now and during covid we saw that with a lot of artists oh like yeah they took it blew up a, a lot of that one of the uh, other hosts that we had right from uh, mango aqui yep. same thing he said during covid started writing mm-hmm. uh not for yes, 15 years later <laughs> yeah it was funny yeah. he said uh, but the same thing uh you know be aware of the caller yeah drop. like that was all covid that was Taking advantage of time, so a nice little jump start. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, man. Yeah. Taking advantage of time. Mm-hmm. Um, I, it, it's. Thank you, man. I mean, just your overall presence, your energy. Thank you, because uh, and you know, and thank you for living up to the expectation of what I already thought, and but you held it to be true, which is, yeah, absolutely. You know, just a a, a, a phenomenal person, mm-hmm. amazing brother, but most importantly, very inspiring, man. Um, it, like genuinely, it's it's really dope to just see 
people creating a new mold um what you shared is true man you know it, it, it's in in what you, a lot of things that you shared are true but what you shared about going down artist alley and to only as a kid see motherfucking representation you could baggy jeans and gold chains <laughs> even though that's who i am today though <laughs> <laughs> I still it. want to see it on the comics, goddamn it! I still want to be different. Yeah. So let, let the record show that Ron uh, is wearing a gold chain and yeah, I know, right? <laughs> some baggy jeans. And the baggy jeans. I will not go to fucking skinny jeans. <laughs> yeah. Stop wearing baggy jeans. Yo, and it, but it's it's like nah, fuck that. Yeah. We are more, and yeah. and, and I and I think I, I thought of that. As I was thinking to myself before we started the episode, I was walking around. I was like, "Where the fuck is my chain?" Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And and but yo, it's it's, but we are more than that. Right. And um, to to not only just put it on paper, but then to to make it, be it, and 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 live it. I think it's it's dope, man. And and to share, you know, you didn't to share your reality of going through, you know a stage of depression that you mentioned and, and pulling yourself out of it and saying fuck that noise to pitching stories on uh, to, to Nickelodeon to saying fuck it there I want to make a cartoon that's too expensive let's pivot let's go back to comic book and not and just, just the utter awareness of not letting an idea die mm -hmm. I think that in itself is a fucking win and a celebration because we are I, and I, I've been a very, I've been a victim of it. I'm quick to, once I hear no, to just let a, a an idea go away and not stand by it. To see if, and, and, and to tie it all back in, it's to see something fully fleshed out, to see if, and, and, and come to life and follow through with it. Yo, that in itself is the fucking win. And, mm -hmm. you know, but not allowing ourselves to settle and being aware that there's more is the goal to reach, right? We, mm. we, we not only want to dream, yeah. we want to have time to daydream. Mm -hmm. Because fuck, why should I be dreaming when I'm sleeping? That's right. I, <laughs> yeah, that's right. I, I should also have space and make space. And, and it goes beyond just earning space because we, we own shit, right? This is our shit. Yeah. So allowing ourselves that moment um, to, to be everything we wish to be. And thank you for reminding me, man. Like, fuck it. Yeah, I don't want... Fuck this part-time job. Yeah. <laughs> There's a, these are a lot of responsibilities. Yes, we do need money. There's a lot of responsibilities. Yeah. We need all these things. Yeah. But as even although we need them, that doesn't mean we should stop and that we can't continue doing what we want to do. And so I, I applaud right. you and I thank you for yeah. reminding me. Hit that applause. Me. Hit that applause. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and so I appreciate you, man, because that's, that in itself is, as you mentioned, it is a lot of work. Yeah. And, um, and I'm glad to, to have this exchange with you where we could even just casually talk about the things that we like. Yeah. Because not, not too many times we even have time for that. We always got to fucking be doing something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, 100%. And so I appreciate you, man. So with that said, you know, um, my brother, thank you all very much for, for coming through. Thank you very much for, for taking the track from the Bronx to the Heights. <laughs> all three of us. Uh, all three. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Bronx yeah. is in the building. <laughs> oh, you in the Bronx now? Yeah, yeah I've been in the Bronx. I'm, I'm, from watching, now? I'm from watching the Heights, too. I told you that like two episodes ago. I said, yo, you were in an island. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shout out no. to Morrison. Yo, South Bronx yo, is in the building. Yo, bro, yo. <laughs> yo. He, he know his uncle's name was Jose. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. What the fuck, fuck is going on? I still don't think that's accurate. We got to put it on the family chat because I don't even know about my We're going to need a post podcast meeting. I'm going to be like, what's Andres' first name? Hey, motherfucker, say Andres, and I look stupid. But I'm telling you, Jose. But thank you very much, Dre. Thank you. Yes, yes. Uh, uh, Francois, I was about to say, I was, I was gonna go from J. Dre J. <laughs> I was like, yeah. I thought that's what you were gonna do. Yeah, yeah, yeah but yeah. I was like, no, then that's too close. But Dre J. Rams is Ron Kane. Just words. Nobody cares. But we all do. <laughs> but we all here do. Uh, and we're out. Thank you. Yes. <laughs>